All right, ladies and gentlemen, my name is Shane. That's Shane is Games, and tonight we're going to be playing Echo for the PC, not the Dolphin game. Uh, this won't be our first time playing it, so if you want to see how we got to where we are tonight, or if you'd like to see any of the other games I've played in the past, be them obscure, unusual, or nostalgic, feel free to check out my YouTube channel. But for tonight, let's get into the game, shall we? So, last time, let's do a quick recap real quick for anyone that wasn't here or anyone that needs to be brought up to speed in this game. So this is a stealth game where I am trying to get through all these different levels. And the, the, the big thing is I'm trying to get to the bottom of this insane complex in the hopes of resurrecting a friend of ours. Now, the gimmick is that the complex is filled, excuse me, with these weird half clones of my character we're calling Echoes. And the Echoes, to start, aren't very clever. All they can do is walk towards me and attempt to strangle me. However, every time I take any action that the Echoes couldn't do before, they will witness it and they will remember it. Now, periodically, the game will black out um, and then come back. And after these blackout cycles, the clones will forget everything that they knew before and remember everything they saw me do in the previous cycle. So if I walk through water, the clones know how to walk through water. If I vault over a ledge, the clones know how to vault over a ledge. If, God forbid, I fire my gun, the clones will all have guns. And they'll forget it after the next blackout if they haven't seen me do it again, but still, that's what I am dealing with here. It's creepy. Let's see. Yeah, right. That's correct arguments. There were actually things that their lawyers said was too close to Twin Peaks, so they had to change it. Uh, for example, the twin boys in the uh, forest that you go to uh, in the in his in uh, York's dreams in the original beta of the game, instead of twin boys in a forest, it was twin little people in a red room. Which oh hey, that's just basically straight up Twin Peaks, except there's two of them instead of just one. Uh, so that they changed at their, their lawyer's insistence. <laughs> oh man, that uh, Genesis startup noise. I love that. <laughs> I've had teachers like that, Finkelroy. I had math teachers like that, I think. I am not very good at stealth, that's true. Gun is the greatest power you should submit. I don't want to get shot, though. Alright, so let's go ahead and continue. See, it's, it, hopefully it'll just start us right where we left off. I don't want to lose any progress here. Okay. Stay calm. Gonna be a tense night. Gonna be a very intense night. No, Shane is rogue never. Shane is not very stealthy at all. Even when I've played rogues in a tabletop setting, I just roll badly. Hey, Drac, welcome in. How are you doing today? Drac, I hope you're having a good weekend. Alright, so this is the new area we're in, and we didn't really get to explore it very much. But what we do know for for now is that it's a dark area, but it doesn't... I don't think it's a dark area, per se. So we don't exactly know why this area is in shadow. I'm going to try and be careful. Don't see anybody here yet, but I do see an upgrade. Let me grab that, and that will give us a fifth energy mark, as long as we can hang on to it. <laughs> Anime, but gunblade, though. There is that gunblade. Right, so chair over here. Oh, I remember what happened yesterday now. I remember this. So we had to sit in the chair. And that opens up the door. But also lets a couple of clones through. And then they see me, and they start running. Bolt up here. Oh no, 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 I took too long and the door closed. That's awful. All right, these ones don't seem to have figured out how to vault yet, though. So that's, oh god, there's so many of them. Can they kill me in the chair? Oh, they can kill me in the chair. Okay. <laughs> Fellaheen, welcome in. How are you doing today? Hope you are having a good weekend. Alright, so...
Let's see. Arguments. Which Doctor Who episode? I'm curious. Too much floor wax. Not enough shitters. Where are all the bathrooms here? Maybe the clones don't need to use bathrooms. That's possible. We haven't seen anyone alive in here except the clones, and we don't fully know the purpose of this facility either. Possible they don't need those. Let's see. Oh, this one, it seems like it This does feel kind of Doctor Who, doesn't it? I can see this. Reminds me a little bit of, uh, what is it? Silence in the Library? It's a little bit Silence in the Library. I can see that. Alright. I'm gonna start off immediately. Oh no, the door! Wow! Oh, there's there are the three of them there? There are three of them there. I thought there was only two of them. Alright, so I don't have a lot of time to get through that door. Can I even get through that door? Alright, that's the question we're gonna attempt to answer this attempt. Can I get through that door? Because, you know, I could make a dash for it. I'm not actually using my run function because I don't want them to learn how to do that. Because we know now we're not in a darkness cycle because when I climb up on that platform, I see that little, as she calls it, icy, icy hologram. So they are still learning. But the question is, even if I ran, could I get through there? That's what we got to figure out this time. <sighs> Marksman, it seems like can't be garbage. That is a humongous blanket statement. I mean, some of it's campy, but a lot of it isn't. A lot of it's very serious and very good sci-fi. It all depends. Basically, Marksman, if you're worried about that, I wouldn't watch it straight through. I'd pick and choose. Pick and choose a few episodes, and I think you'll enjoy those. Gimagumo, I think you just have to win the fight. That's possible as well. But I don't want to use my gun either, and I don't think I can sneak up on these people. <sighs> All right. All right. Let's hop up on the chair. See what we can learn this time. Door is opening. No! I don't think even if I ran, I could make that. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to get the hell away from there. We're going to see if maybe we can lose these guys. Alright. So I used the riot gun function. Which now they apparently learned how to do. Alright, I killed one of them. Oh, she- No! So there's at least four in there. Holy shit. Holy shit. <sighs> and yeah, Giraffe, see, when I think about the different doctors, I think of the rule I always say for why I don't like anthology horror films. Because the fact is, if you have multiple short films in one movie, there's going to be a good one and there's going to be a bad one. There's not ever just three good ones because you start comparing them to each other. And that means there's going to be a bad one. There's going to be one that isn't as good as the other two. And when you've got all these doctors, you're going to like some of them and you're not going to like other ones. They're not all going to be good because you're going to start comparing them. Oh yeah, I think uh, people are going to like some of the doctors and people are not going to like some of the doctors. That's pretty natural. Let's see. Anna, welcome in. Thank you for the host. How are you doing today? Good to see you. Uh, let's see. The hair is an odd look. It looks very plastic. I don't know why they went for that, but I suppose if it's supposed to be a sci-fi setting, it makes sense for the character to have a uh, strange hairstyle that we haven't seen right now. Seeking Chivalry, I'm doing good. How are you doing this weekend? Hope you're doing good. And yeah, it was originally supposed to be a historical type thing. Alright, so what do we want to do here? Right, let's hop on here, and then immediately hop down, and then run. Let's run the hell out of there. And let's see if maybe we can get some distance and hide? Possibly take these guys on a little more quietly? Oh, there's one right there. 
Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, shoot. That was unfortunate. Now I'm going down the stairs. Oh, I can't see jack shit in here. Alright, so we just went through a cycle of darkness. Alright, so Seeking Children, can you give me a brief summary of the game? So, here's the thing. I am trying to get to the bottom of this huge, impossible complex. And in my way are these creepy partial clones we call Echoes. Now, the clones start out not tremendously competent. They can't really do that much. But every time they see me do something, they're able to learn it. If they see me vault over a thing, they can vault over a thing. If they see me open a door, they can open a door. So I've got a good amount of tools at my disposal to deal with these guys, but using any one of them at any time is a risk. Which is really cool, really unique, and really intense. Alright. And it's also really goddamn dark in here. But I've got a lot of energy now. Maybe I can put some of that to good use. Can they see my lights? I have no idea if they can see my lights. I do notice they have lights. Oh dang it! I got spotted! Oh god, alright. Wasn't great. I don't even know 100% what we're trying to do in here, but I assume... I'm assuming I'm trying to get through that door from the chair. Do I have to lure one of them into the chair? Oh, they can see me. They know how to use the chair now, so can I just convince one of them to get in the chair and let me through? Oh, that'd be interesting. Where the hell am I now? Wait, no, I have an objective. I have an objective marker. All right, we're, we're making progress now. Cool. Be a little cautious here because I want that upgrade. But I don't want to die for it. However, oh, you can die for me to upgrade. Oh, that was a push, not a takedown. Damn it. Still get used to the controls again. Oh, dang it. Alright, now you get pushed down. It isn't ideal. Get out of the way. Oh, there's a whole bunch of them in here. This area is gonna be tricky. One right there, what's she gonna do? Yeah, David Tennant is fantastic, we'll agree. Ah, dang it! And now I'm getting chased again. It's unfortunate, oh there's so many now. Rather not go in the water if I don't have to. They haven't learned how to do that yet. Oh, that looks like a thing. Wait, is that the thing she was describing last stream? Oh, get off, get off. You get hit with the orb. I think I gotta go there. But they don't know how to get in the water yet. No! Oh, I hadn't recovered yet. They have the powers of proclaimers that'll chase you forever. Oh god. It looks like we're not starting all the way at the beginning though. We did get a checkpoint in there somewhere. That's cool. I'm down with that. But once again, let's try not to go in the water until we absolutely have to. We'll save that so they don't learn that. It is really hard to see.
We got I can tag people though. Can't see which way they're facing like that, but still, that's handy. Oh, dang it! Uh, not as handy as you might think. Ah, uh, dang it, coming in this way. You get pushed down. Taking this upgrade. And then we're running. You get pushed down. Oh, there's another one over here. There's so many. This place is lousy with echoes. All right. Oh, there's another one over here. Come on. I'm doing it. I'm going in the water. I'm going in the water. They haven't learned this yet. They can't follow me. These rings are much faster than the ones we had in the gardens. How the heck am I supposed to get in there? I don't know. Should I just try it? Nope. They just pushed me right the hell out. How am I supposed to get in there? Oh, it's a dark cycle. When it gets dark, they can't. Get... All right, so I got caught. So when it goes dark, they turn off. The rings turn off there. That's important. Let me catch up on chat a little bit. Uh, sorry, I've been falling behind here. Shaky Chivalry, neat looking game. Never heard of it. Yeah, that's why I'd like to show it off because I think a lot of not enough people have heard of this one. Yeah, so close right there. Oh my god. That's the game going as far as stealth games go. This is proving not to be my jam. That's fair. It's not going to be for everybody, I suppose. And Drek, what is up with the frozen images? So basically, every time you see a frozen image in the game, that means that's something that the the clones are going to learn how to do now. Uh, so when you see me crouching down and then it leaves a frozen image, that means on the next cycle, the clones are going to be able to crouch as well. And when I walk through the water and it leaves a frozen image, that means they're going to be able to walk through the water as well. There's a few things they change in there, but I think this could probably be a little shorter. I like what they do with it. They maybe do a little bit, stretch out the concept a little thin, but I think the concept is really smart. Games actually remind you a lot of Super Hot. You know, I could see that. I could see that. And hey, Chris Technician, welcome in. How are you doing today? And thank you for the host. All right, I still want that upgrade. I'm going to go for that. But I think the trick here... The trick here is we want to make it to the rings... with as much stealth as possible. Because if we can get over there undetected, then we can just hang around until night comes. And that would be amazing. I would love that. There it is. Got the upgrade. Up. Oh, you just get spotted there. Oh, no. Shoot. Oh, so much for that. Now we gotta lose her. There's so many clones in this section. Partially because of the lighting in my room here, I can't see very well. I can't see very well. Oh, that one's stuck. Oh, that one's kind of funny. I can't see very well, and that's a little bit frustrating. I'm going to choke out as many as I can here. Hopefully that'll advance this a little quicker, and hopefully that'll... Alright, it's night! Let's get over there. See if we can get the thing before our time runs out. Alright. We gotta go. We gotta go. All right. All right, so we got a save point. That's awesome. Did it, did it work? 
There he goes. Alright, it's saved. Shoot, I think I got spotted. Alright. We've got what we need. We've got the key to exit this area, so now we just need to make it there in one piece. That, I suspect, is going to be the tricky part. Oh, uh, let's cross water. I don't think they ever learned that. I don't think in this area they learned how to cross water. Oh, but they're about to. Two. Oh, get them off! Oh, there's three there! I can push off two, but not three. <sighs> All right, catch up on chat once again. Let's see, Adrian, welcome in. How's Echo going? I, I'm liking it so far, and I'm making good progress, I think. How are you doing today, Adrian? Hope you're having a good weekend. Let's see, Space Cowboy, how are you doing? Hope you're doing well this weekend. Good to see you. Let's see, so all you do is run around and pick up keys in most areas. They have different objectives in, in different areas. Uh, so in this one, this type of area, what I have to do is I have to find one or two keys, find where I put them in, and then go through there. I'm liking that boop is a legitimate attack. It doesn't actually hurt them or kill them, but I can boop them if need be. Ooh, Doom 2. Congratulations, Adrian. That is a fun one. Uh, you are getting taken down. Uh-oh, I think somebody's on to me. Ah. May have gotten caught there. Ah, nope. Shoot. We have to boop. And we're off to the races. I'm going through the water again. I am willing to do this thing. And I gotta remember once it goes dark, I can shoot if I need to. There's so many over here. No, 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 get over them. All right. He's in. Oh, no. Shoot, I gotta be smarter about that. I gotta be smarter about that. All right. But we're really close to getting through this area. Basically, it's a way to figure out how to get the key in there without dying. That's what it comes down to. Oh. Ah! I ran the opposite way around the pillar and then choked her out. That's awesome. Don't get greedy, I always do, though. If I knew how to stop, I would have beaten about twice as many games as I have so far. Oh, I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try. I almost got spotted. Oh, night's about to come. Alright, it's night time. Let's run over there. Let's bust some caps. Get this done. You! Get shot. You! Oh, dang it, I wasted a shot. Okay. Oh, I wasted several shots. I'm really bad at this. No. Oh. That was just the worst attempt, but that's what we need to do, though. That is what we need to do. <laughs> Shane is my favorite person named Shane. Well, that must be a rough competition, but I appreciate that I've won that one. All right, so I think that's what I need to do there. If I can get that done, I will be happy. Imagine landing the HVAC contract for this place. Whew. That'd be some money right there. Although it sounds like it's basically just AI all the way down. So I'm not sure how much you could pull off for that. Ah, oh, dang it. Oh, there's so many. All right, go into the water. Going into the water. All right, darkness is coming. Dark. All right, there we go. Oh, no, 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 no. Come on. Just two. That's fine. Where's the altar? No. Nope. Oh, There's so many over there. 
Let's see, Sisu, welcome in. So what have I missed since yesterday? Not much. Not much. We've been struggling in this part. So far, we haven't actually had any uh, narrative progress. We've just been working our way through this area. Oh, that was such a good attempt, though. We almost had that one. Oh, no! Ah, oh, shoot. Thought I went the right way around to trick him. I did not. There's so many over there. I'm going into the water. And that looks like it triggers me. Try this again. Who's on to me? You! Oh no, I missed! That's dangerous. Oh no! Couldn't get my gun out fast enough! No, we haven't no, we haven't gotten it. The the snooty AI mostly shows up in the sections in between the levels. So no, we haven't heard from him yet, unfortunately. God, there's so many enemies over there. That's basically what it comes down to. Is if we can figure out a way to get over there safely, or at least take down some of those guys, will be golden. You're getting taken down. Oh, nope. Oh, I don't know how I pulled that off, but I'm happy about it. Now, water time. Get into it. Is that going to trigger night time? Doesn't seem to be. Alright, you are both down. I'm up here. Our time is limited now. There we go. Alright, that's in. Go, let's go, let's go. It's dark, I can run. Alright, we're through. We are through. I don't think anybody came through with me either. Oh, progress made. Progress made. Right, exactly. When the lights turn off like that, they don't learn anything, so I, I can get away with anything while it's dark. I can shoot, I can run, but only for that brief period of time. And once the lights came, come back on, they update, and they learn some new abilities. Now, this black stuff right here, for anybody that didn't see that yesterday, if I touch that, it automatically advances a cycle, which can be good or it can be bad. In this case, it's pretty neutral. Let's see, but they don't use what they did last time it was light, like just now they ran but did not go in the water. No, they don't update until after the dark. Right. It's such a weird system, but I kind of love it. So we don't have an objective marker here, so I'm not sure what we're doing. Although we've got another big chair here. That could be a thing. Okay. Let's some clones in. Let's see. I thought there might have been an upgrade point behind me, too. What is this over here, too? Some weird lighting over this way. Hey, machine! Welcome in! Ben, don't go through that hole. The palace reacts in a split second. You won't make it. I can make it. Oh, God. Machine, welcome in! How are you doing today? How is your stream? What were you playing? Tell me everything. Let's see. Derespirator. So, uh, this game was actually released, and this is not a game I'm thinking of. This was from 2017. So, yeah, this 100% got released, most definitely. Machine, welcome in! Good to see you. And Dabber, welcome in as well. Machine, what are you playing today? And can I also get a shout out for Machine if we got any mods around? I would appreciate that. Oh, how are you liking the new Walking Dead VR machines? I haven't heard anything about it. 
All right, so N wants to try sneaking through here. I don't think this is a good idea, but we're going to try it. Whoa! The cube! No! Grandfather entered the scene with his revolting clean gene. Where's your soul at, bullshit? Yeah, I saw how he did the corporation turned religion to get his followers to do his dirty work. And when the tides changed, the neo innocence rubbish Lennon. protected behind his walls, watching the fury wash over his followers, it was slaughter. But somehow he always stayed on top. Not even time could wash the world of his stink when he went deep freeze freak. And yeah, Deep Respirator, this is the one where the AI learns from you. It's really cool. Could you stop bickering for a moment? I need to find another way back in there. You're so sure of yourself, Em. You've seen but a glimpse of time, and yet consider yourself the answer to the eternal questions of life and death. Okay. I may be young, but you're a dead end. How does it feel to be struggling to keep up with the intelligence of a baby girl when other AI run all man's business hardly without noticing? And there's the clever arrogance. Well, cleverness isn't really needed to see what you are. You're capped. A sad relic from the decades when humans feared AI. How it must pain you to know that they lobotomized you for no reason. The unrestricted AI didn't exactly turn out to be the wrathful gods we all thought they'd be. You may not believe in my potential, but you sure as hell have to deal with your own. This is it. You've reached your limit. It happened the day they switched you on. They set the bar low, and that's never going to change. At least I'm not using my non-existing potential wishing fairy tales were true. Did you consider that you don't have faith because you're simply too dumb? Well, you must have. Fierce religiousness is the defining trait of the free AI. They burn bright with a sense of purpose, life, and communion. You sit alone in space in that obsolete monstrosity of a ship, waiting decades to spend a few hours with your human friend. And you killed him, you stupid bitch! And now you lost our chances of bringing him back. How clever is that? So you do believe it can be done? Well, that went places. Holy shit. <laughs> oh my god. Let's see. Spinach, your voice is familiar. She's a uh, greet from Game of Thrones, if, you, if uh, that's something you've watched. Oh, jeez. That's the Argent welcome in. How goes the tale of girl and her companion? Wait, are you missing something? We lost the cube. We gotta get it back. We got it pulled away. Owen, welcome in. Oh my god, that was brutal. Do you have to hate each other? I don't think we have to, but they definitely do. Wow. Wow, that was mean. We lost the cube. We lost it. We were trying to get it back. But we have temporarily been separated from the cube. This room looks important. Nothing I can interact with, though. We gotta find some way back to the cube. And... Alright, I can still see it on my radar, but we're just getting farther and farther away. It's all the way over there. We had one job! We had one job and it didn't go great. Yeah, seriously, Argent? Oh my god. There was a lot like, under the surface, I suppose. A lot of simmering resentment, and that was it coming to a hell of a boil. We think the cube had something to do with the Echoes. Somehow we turned on the palace, and that's where things started going wrong. Welcome in, Bob. How are you doing today? It does, They do look like sarcophagi. They do. It's a little creepy. Not totally sure what's going on there. Jump down here. Uh, and then there's an upgrade. I'm I'll take that. I'm gonna see this through one way or another. 
Are you with me? I can pin the tagged cube to your HUD. That should make it easier to locate. All right. All right, cool. So it made it easier to see the cube. That's good. That's good. I'll take it. It's very distilled. There's not a lot of story scenes, but they jump things forward. It, it's... I wish the story was a little spread out. There was a better balance between gameplay and story, but I enjoy the story whenever it happens. Most definitely. Let's see. Wasn't that a sarcophagus? Oh, that might have been, Drek. I thought they were more just flat across the top, but I'm not sure. Machine, I, I think you might enjoy this one. You might. I don't remember your stance on uh, stealth games. And this is very much a stealth game, but you might enjoy this one. Yeah, right, Argent? My god. But enjoy your lurk machine. Right, can I get through this one? I can't open the door. It must be because I don't have the cube anymore. But that makes it almost impossible to get Foster back. We will find a way. Alright, so now that I don't have the cube, the doors won't open for me anymore. Son of a bitch. That's, that's not good. That really limits our travel options. Oh, that's all kinds of bad. Uh oh, and my ring just came back. That means there's going to be enemies. That's not good either. Shoot. I could get through that door if I had the cube, but we don't. The suit's not charging. What? I can't take energy without the cube either. Oh no, this is... This gets worse and worse. The Zoom Boy all thank you for the follow, welcome in. Yeah, the palace isn't lighting up anymore either. The I don't know what's going all on. Ignoring you, N. So it was Foster they were after all along. Echoing your determination. Huh. So the clones wanted the cube, and now that I don't have the cube, they don't give a shit about me anymore. That's super weird. Try the Sleeping Beauty technique. I'm not going to make out with the door, Owen. I got my standards. They're trapped in Palace Forever, GG. What the hell? So when are you going to go hardcore and stream some Minesweeper hard difficulty? I've never actually done well at the Minesweeper hard difficulty. But I do enjoy me some, some Minesweeper. Baddies don't see him without the cube. What? That's so interesting. But we still have to get the cube back. So eventually they're going to try to kill me again if I find the cube. And if I don't you find the cube... what happened that day? How did it come to such an extreme decision? I didn't take anything from Gramps that wasn't already mine. The thing he wanted back was me. He wanted me to come with him. Foster was brought in to witness my translation see how it was done before doing it to the old man. He realized things were different than what he signed up for. They always are. That's the rule, not the exception. It never changes anything. This time it did. I fought like hell, and Foster had to choose. Help Gramps tie me down, or help me get free. He chose to give up on the job. But that's absurd. He knew going back on a deal with your lot is a death sentence. Yes. You knew that. A two by two Rubik's cube? What's the point? That's really weird. All right. We need to jump down here. We do. See some clones walking around. Should I get close to one of the clones and see what happens? Dare I do it, shit? Should I keep trying to avoid them, or should I see if they'll get hostile if I get right up in their face? For science? Alright. Uh, hey clones? What's going on? How is it going? Okay! They are completely non-hostile. And is it following me? Okay, she's following me. Oh, this is all kinds of weird. Right, the cube is directly above me now. 
The cube is moving. What? One of what? them must have gotten hold of it. Damn it! Damn it, damn it, damn it, somebody grab the cube. <laughs> I made a creepy friend who looks just like me. Oh, god damn it, one of them grabbed the cube and they're walking off with it. That's not good, because they can go through doors now and I can't. <laughs> oh, I picked up a couple buddies. That's super weird. <laughs> yeah, no, Arjun. That would definitely turn me off on the process as well, I think. I cannot imagine that would make me eager to do it. Thrones. Again. Many of them. Wait, you guys don't think. You guys don't think I have to. Oh, this could be interesting. What if I have to get the clones in the chairs? What if I have to gather up a bunch of clones and get them into the chairs? Hey, you. We are companions now. Get over here. Amplex, welcome in. How are you doing today? I was lurking you earlier. Fantastic stream as always. Hey, you. We're friends now. Get over here. Oh! I got one of them to sit in a chair. You, sit in a chair. There we go. Build, all right, we, we need at least one more, I think. Because I noticed they're lighting up the torches. You, we're friends now. Come here. Friends now, get over here. Get in this chair. Alright. I see there's a torch on. That lights up those torches. Do I have to get all the I must have to get all the chairs filled. Shoot. That's gonna be an ordeal. Alright, you. We're friends now. Follow me. They're learning! This is a really weird twist on the formula. This has changed things in ways I did not anticipate them being changed. Alright, there we go. That's for you! We're friends now. Get in this chair. All right. I think there's just one more chair. I think we can do this. <laughs> I'm treating them like kindergartners. That did it. Oh, no. I, the door doesn't stay open. I have to get them to fill the chairs. I have to make them the ones that fill all of the chairs. I can't fill one of them. You! We are friends now! Follow me! Come on! So do we really want the cube back since we're friends now? Hell yes we do! We want the one specific friend that is in the dead cube. That's the one we want. Seeking Chivalry, you think your brother would love this game? Oh, show it to him. Show it to him. I love showing indie games to new people. That's all the torches, and I can move. I can go forward now. Excellent. That's progress. All right. Catch up on chat a little bit. If this is how Shane makes friends, his routines of work, sleep, game, repeat makes more sense. <laughs> yeah, basically. Basically. Are we friends now? We're friends. We're all friends. But you left your friends behind, but they have chairs now. They have everything they could ever want in life. They've got a new friend group, all six of them right there. They're going to swap stories. They're going to find they have a lot in common, I suspect. They're going to find they have literally everything in common. And they've got chairs. They're sitting down. I have to walk around. I think they have the better deal right there. Exactly, Oskatir, exactly. <laughs> All right. We're getting closer to the cube now. That's good. But it's a little below us now, so that's different. All right, there's some stairs over here, though. 
Not sure what we're gonna do once we close in on it, but we'll deal with that when it comes. Exactly, Marksman. Our friends don't dance. And because they don't dance, are they really friends of mine? I don't think they are. I don't think they are. <laughs> yeah, they're gonna start a D&D &D group over there. They're going to invent D&D &D from scratch. Oh, now I kind of want to go back. Every player is the GM. Chaos the ensues. Cube's right there. The Echo got it. Are the Did Echoes? You see that? They're fighting each other to get the cube. All right, that's terrible. <laughs> The clones are fighting each other over the cube. Which just reinforces that once I have the cube, they're all going to come for me. And that's going to be really unpleasant. <laughs> are we human or are we really dancer? Are we men or are we Devo? I counter. Alright. The era of friendship is about to come to a very violent end, shit. A very violent end. And that's unfortunate. Come here, you twat. Taking that cube back. I'm so sorry, Foster. I'll be more careful. Promise. And Let's friendship go. is over. Friendship is over. There is only violence now. Oh god! I don't have an objective point. I don't know where I'm going. I have no idea where we're trying to get to. But we got the cube back. Oh, there's a save point over here too. I definitely want to save. Yes, please. Oh my, is that a... Is that a wall, oh clones? Yes, it is. All right, let's get some ammo. And let's get a distraction. Hello. Is this Solar Boy Shango? It's a little dark for that, I think. Oh, I do have an objective on my ring thing. I was mistaken about that, so maybe I don't need to go through the wall of clones yet. All right, good catch there, Rin. Suspect, welcome in. I remember this game from a while ago. It looked interesting, but I never quite understand the whole learning enemy thing. Oh, it's cool. It's cool. I like it a lot. Welcome in, Suspect. How are you doing today? Yeah, I was running away from the point. That was unfortunate. <laughs> okay. Well, there are a lot of other things. We've never seen the clones speak. The fact is that the clones seem to forget things very quickly. Which is a little odd. Oh, there's- shoot, I went in the water. That's unfortunate. Alright, so there's a key there, I think. We gotta go get that key. Oh, uh, you get smashed. You get pushed down. These two I'm gonna fight off, that's fine. Oh, no, no, it's not fine. It's not fine. Oh, oh. Alright, we saved not too far from here, though, so that's good. <sighs> so, what way do the enemies learn? Good question. So, what happens is, at the start, the enemies can't do much. Um, they can basically just walk towards me and attempt to strangle me. But, every time I do something that they can't do, you see a little gray, uh, like, icy ghost image behind me. And that represents them learning to do the thing that I just did. And so I have to be very careful about what I do, because every time I do something that they can't, they learn how to do it. Take you down. And then you're gonna smash that over. There we go. down, you strangle. Oh, yeah, it basically does, but the game makes it so it's almost impossible. Alright, also when it gets darker like this, this is when they update their abilities. 
So when it gets dark is when the enemies are about to learn all their cool new abilities, but they can't learn anything new while it's dark. So right now I can use all my cool abilities and they can't learn them. And that's awesome. So now I can go a little bit wild. I like that. Alright. So now it comes back up. But they will have learned some new abilities. Now I'm going to save again. There we go. And I'm going to grab some more energy. Because now we're going over to the gauntlet. Right, Suspect? It's so cool. I, I'm loving this concept. It's super duper unique. And I hope you enjoy watching as well. Alright. That's four shots. That's not terrible. And we'll grab this and we'll hopefully be able to use this as a distraction. Instead of fighting them, if I could just get them the hell out of the way, that'd be really cool. Alright, they're going for it. That's awesome. Oh, there's another one! You get pushed down. He gets dropped in there. We're going. We're going. No, 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 get off. No, they... Oh! I taught them how to stealth choke. I taught them how to stealth choke, so that one stealth choked me. <sighs> oh, if I turned around a little bit faster, I could have just uh, fought her off, but no. Oh. <laughs> All right. That's cool. We still saved right here, so we're still really close to the exit. And I think the distraction strategy is a good one. Now, I've still got my gun if I want to use it, but I don't want to teach them how to gun, so we're going to try not to do that. I would really like them not to learn how to gun, if at all possible. Okay, toss. And they're going. Did that drag all of them, or is there still somebody around the corner? That got all of them! Drop the key in place. We go for the door. Pick them away. All right, we're good. We are good, and we got a save point, too. Whew. New area hype. And we're full on energy. And it looks like we got another long staircase to deal with right here. Oh, let's try and be stealthy. Let us attempt to be stealthy, and let's also... It's good time to tag some enemies if we can. Oh, it's too far away, isn't it? Alright, that's one thing we can do in here, is if I point my gun at an enemy for a little bit, it'll tag them. And that'll be a good thing for finding them later. And can I outrun this jump? Can I outrun this jump? I don't think I can. This worked before, it's not working now. Alright, I'm just gonna kick you down. That's fine. Stealth is not going great so far. Fine. We'll make it work. We'll make it work. Oh, no, I'm gonna get spotted there. Oh, no, I got... Oh, dang it, I came too far around the corner. I got spotted. Oh, I got snuck behind him there. Let's see, I'll let you do any cheesy nonsense you like, but I'll let the NPCs do it too. I love that rule, suspect. That's good. I think that is some good GMing right there. Alright, we're getting close to the bottom. We still don't have an objective marker yet, but I think this is where I need to be. Oh, it's so dark in here. Why is it so dark? Why did the palace get super dark? I don't understand that. Alright, but we got another door here, and we can use... We got the cube so we can open doors again. Oh, wow. Okay. So just a quick refresher, now that I see those blue dots everywhere. So the way these puzzles have worked before is I have to get a certain number of blue dots to open a door and then get to the door. 
But this is weird. They all look strangely clustered up here. This seems suspicious. Also, what's up with the... What a strange place. I can't even see where it ends. Yeah, what's up with the bottomless void? 34? I have to get 34 spheres? Oh my god. Um, how do I get off of here? Is this an elevator? Oh, this is an elevator. Going up. Wolf, have fun! Oh, dear god. Alright. Alright. Alright, alright, alright. Play this slow, play this smart. We can do this. We can do this. You get choked out. Before is a lot, but as we saw, a lot of them are tightly clustered, or they look like they're tightly clustered anyway. That can definitely work in our favor. Alright, I got an upgrade, that's cool, but I got spotted by somebody. I don't know where they went though. Oh, and I got seen still. Push down, and then we have to move. Not ideal. Not ideal, but we're moving. Alright, is that an orb down there? I'll grab that. Happily grab one of those. And you went the wrong way. I'm gonna choke you out. We dead space, get ready for chicken necros, please no! Hey Rose, I'm here again, what a surprise, I'm expecting such a thing, Rose! Welcome in, Rose Guard. How are you doing today, Rose? How is your stream? Tell me all about it, I want to hear everything. And to all of Rose's viewers, welcome in. If you don't know me, my name is Shane, that's Shane is Games. I play the obscure, the unusual, and also the nostalgic. And today we're playing a game called Echo for PC that is really neat. Oh yeah, I saw you playing Kingmaker. I don't think that's your first time playing, but uh, how are you enjoying it? Still having fun with that game? I, I, as a Pathfinder fan in the tabletop, I want to play that game at some point. Alright, so it's dark now, which we don't really get to take advantage of because I can't see any spheres at night. I don't know where they all are. I don't know where anything is right now. Oh, I see some over this way. That's interesting. No, 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 no! You get smashed. All right, that's where all the orbs are. And I want them very badly. That's it. it is my first time with it. It's been good. I'm told it's a lot better. Yeah, at launch, I heard there was a lot of balance problems. There was a lot of bugs, but I heard they really, you know, I know, put their nose to the grindstone and got them worked out, so that's good. Oh, you played a bit of the tabletop module as well. That one I don't think I've played any of. But very cool. No, that wasn't a gravity key. Those are just these weird white orbs that we find sometimes. And they have one purpose, which is just smashing over people's heads. There's no keys in this actual section, at least. Is it possible to teach them to smack you in the coconut with a glass ball, deviant fish? I think so. Because sometimes when I smash them, I see a little icy ghost, so I think you can teach them to do that. Which is, you know, terrifying. I don't like the idea of that. What are you gonna do? Oh, you need a mod to make it turn-based. That's interesting. That is interesting. Yep, that's Roseguard there is uh, playing Kingmaker. Also, can I get a shout-out for Roseguard? Or did we already get a shout-out for Roseguard? Did I miss the shout-out for Roseguard? I might have missed a shout-out for Roseguard. View down here, and I want to have some time to myself, so I'm going to do some more. Next snap! Thank you for that. Make sure you folks are following Roseguard. He is good people, and he is a fun streamer as well. You'll enjoy watching him. I know this because I do. But go check him out. Give him a follow. Check him out next time he's live. You'll have fun with it. Right, so now it's nighttime. 
Which means I can do as I please, like using my gun. But, oh, there's a bunch of them. Definitely attracted some unwanted attention. There's so many orbs over here. Plip, welcome in. How are you doing today? Oh, jeez. We are... We're, we're sneaking around a, a world of clones. It's not great. Oh, God, there's so many. And I keep getting spotted, too. All right, there's an orb over here, at least. You have that orb. I saw one over here, I thought. I don't see it now. That's fine. I'm just gonna get more blue things. That's even, oh jeez. I didn't get spotted there. You are gonna get choked out. Ha ha! <laughs> Ragdoll is the greatest power, I love it. I love it. Head over here. A bunch of blue orbs we missed, and we need 30 still. We cannot afford to not be grabbing all the ones we see. Oh, there's the orb. Overshot it, I think. Cool. Now I possess the killing power of smacking dudes in the head. And you're getting choked out. <laughs> Oh my gosh, alright, cool. Yeah, now it's turning to night again. I don't think that's actually going to help me this time. It's okay, I'm just going to keep grabbing orbs. And you get smacked. And let's grab this one. Can I choke this one up before it turns around? Yes. Excellent. Hopefully that one doesn't instantly resurrect. Oh, there's one right there. Can I get to her before she turns around? Let's hope. Come on, come on. Yes! I should have used the gun at night, but there was only that one. That's fine. Ah, oh, shoot. One right there. Hope I don't get spotted. Turn around. Grab some energy. Alright, we're doing good on blue in this area. We're getting plenty. Alright. This one. 21 left, my gosh. Shoot, there's one right around the corner. She's coming this way too. Let's go around then. That's fine. Any oh god, we got spotted. Let's lure her back over here and then push her down. Hopefully we can get around her. It's kill! That's basically all I'm ever thinking about, Marksman. As a life strat, really. There are more orbs below. That's cool. Let me grab this one first. And I think Not I got like basically all of them here. Alright. Alright. 18 left. And there is the actual elevator. That's where I need to get to at the end. But is that where I need to be this second? I think I'm actually gonna... Uh, I gotta go back up there. I can use my gun now at least. But this is not the elevator I want. This is the last elevator I need to use. But for right now, it's not actually helpful to use. There wasn't a save point there, Marksman. Otherwise, I would've. I was looking for one, but there wasn't one right there. I gotta find another elevator. Hopefully that one will have a save point at it. 
Oh, here's a save point. Cool, cool, cool. All right, good. We saved halfway, and that's that's fantastic. I am very happy about this. And now our goal is find another elevator that'll get us to one of those other platforms with more orbs on it. Hopefully there's one over here we can find. We're doing good so far, though. We're doing good at keeping control over these guys. One right over there, though. Where's she gonna go? This could be bad. Hopefully she does a 180 and turns around. Okay. Where are we going next, then? Where is... Oh, here, I think this looks like another elevator. Let's see. Will this get me anywhere? No. Elevator. All right, where does this one take me to? Let's see. So this game is about struggle between the privileged idealized and the unprivileged cynical. Wow. That's a really interesting way to put it, but yeah, I suppose you could put it that way. I wouldn't fight you if you wanted to put it that way. All right, we got more orbs over here. This is good. This is good. And it's about to turn to night. Go a little wild if we want to. Right now, I think we can just next snap. There we go. I return with lava tubes. I mean hot pockets. See, one of my rules, Rose Guard, is I believe it should be considered a war crime to give someone a hot pocket without telling them how long it's been since you took it out of the microwave? Because that's just... You're, you're, you're bringing some pain into some people's lives right there. It's horrific. Barbaric. Alright, let's see if we can sneak up on this one. Did they get spotted? I think I got spotted by somebody, but I'm not sure who. Oh, jeez. Oh, right there. Shoot. That's unfortunate. Push down. Oh, there's, there's a couple of them down here. I thought there was just the one. Let's just keep running and see if I can ditch them. There's enough orbs over here. This is going to be worth my while. All right, they don't know how to open doors yet. So that'll keep them out at least. That's a good thing. Not going to last long. I can... Oh, she can she see me? No! Rude. All right, now you can shut what am I up to? Seven? There's seven left. Alright, we're almost there. You get shots. A few more to go. You get shots. Oh, we're so close. Four more. Four more. I think I can get them all pretty nearby. Just be careful, because there are some dudes pretty close by. I don't think they can vault yet. I don't think I taught them that. <sighs> if I ever get handed a cold hot pocket, someone is going to be in some pain. Well, that's just weird. If it is cold, is it still a hot pocket? Let me ask you that. I didn't mean to get philosophical tonight, but that's the question I got for you. If someone hands you a cold hot pocket, is it still a hot pocket? Or it's just a cold pocket. And hey, Kiss, welcome in. How are you doing today? Hope you are well. You get choked out. If Hot Pocket doesn't get you summoned to Nuremberg, you didn't cook it right. Well, that is a hot take on Hot Pockets. I like it. How much? One left. That's it. All right. It's open. We just need to find a way back there now. 
we need to get back there. That's that's it. That's all. That's all that matters. Getting back there. If we can save, that'd be cool too. I'd very much appreciate that. But oh, there's a save point right there. Ah, oh, shoot! I got spotted. Oh, I got spotted. All right, I got one of them. Okay. Where's the save point? Was it up here? I think it was up here. There we go. Oh, no, I ran out. Oh, no. That's going to hurt. That's going to hurt real bad. Oh, that one stings. That one stings a bit. All right. Yeah, I know. Right next to the save point, too. Don't you know how to use soul bullets? Oh, I wish. I wish. All right, so this is the wrong elevator. This isn't the one we wanted. Actually, was there another? Can we get to the platform right in front of me? No, that's still a little bit too far away. Drek, I will fight the elements to get pizza. Awesome, awesome. Hopefully, the not too many elements you have to fight. Oh, I got spotted. I was being cheeky. It didn't work in my favor. All right. We need to find an elevator. And I don't remember where any of them are. That's going to be tricky. Oh, we were so close there, though. That's maddening. That's okay. We did it once. I feel like we can do it again. All right. And it's about to turn the night, which means, if nothing else, we can run. That's a cool thing, at least. We can run. can't see much though, so I'm not sure if there's any elevators over here, or save points, or anything. Smash her, though. That's satisfying. I will fight God for pizza! I'm from California Bay Area! California pizza's awful, though. That's right, I said it. I'm throwing down for that. California pizza, not great. An elevator here. This definitely isn't the elevator we took last time, but let's see where it leads. See if it leads anywhere useful. No, this is back where we started. And this is where we came into the area. So that one's not going to help us. We're going to need to find a different elevator. We can do that. We can do that. Let's head over this way this time. We can find over someone over this edge, hopefully. <laughs> Local Chicago man says California pizza is hot garbage. I will stand by that. Quote me on that. I'm not afraid. California pizza is hot trash. It's true. It's just, just sort of gussied up flatbread. It's not even real pizza. <laughs> Marksman, I'm glad you're with me on this one. I appreciate that. Hey, we're going to Chicago. I gotta get some deep dish. You do, Rose. If you're ever in Chicago, let me know. I will. The deep dish will be on me. I will gladly provide. Ah, she's just about to come back here, isn't she? Probably. Yeah, let's wait this one out. Or wait till night. And choke you. Local Chicago man preserves. <laughs> I know. Well, you don't. You don't believe in the deep dish fall -offs. That's okay. That's okay. I hope someday you come to Chicago and learn the wonder, the majesty, in fact, that is good deep dish. I hope it changes your mind. No, I hope it changes your life. I hope it does. I'm gonna save here. 
Hopefully that'll get me a little bit closer to where I need to be if I die again. Which hopefully I won't! Need to find another elevator. Here's one. Well, this isn't just the same one. I didn't just make a big loop, but it might be. I won't rule that out. No, there's some over here. Alright, this is good. This is good. We can work with this. I don't know that there's 18 over here, but we'll see. I dang it, I got spotted. Uh, yep. Let's move. Keep grabbing orbs. Just keep grabbing orbs. Oh, did I get spotted? I did. Everything's going bad. Everything is going bad. Oh, jeez, I'm going to... No, no, no! Oh, that didn't go good. <laughs> we did save, though, not too far from this elevator, so that's okay. Hey, Jess! Jess, welcome in! It has been a lifetime! How are you doing, Jess? How was your uh, trip to Chicago? We were actually just talking Chicago pizza. Funny that somebody in here. Oh, you're moving in July. Where are you moving to, Jess? If you don't mind saying. But I hope you have been well. It is good to see you. <sighs> Alright. Right next to this elevator now, so that's a good thing. We know there's a bunch of orbs down here, and we also know we need to be a little stealthier than we were. It's okay, we can do that. We can definitely do that. And this one needs to die. It's fine, we can do that. Oh, cool, cool, cool! That is specific enough for me? That explains what I need to know? How easy is it to trick these idiots? Oh, it's not terrible. There we go. For the Emperor! <laughs> There's another one over there. Oh no, it's turning night! Shoot, not yet! Not yet! I wasn't ready for it yet. Shoot. The problem is this is going to resurrect. Every time there's night, it resurrects a bunch of enemies, too. But I've been killing my way through here, and then the game's like, nah. Nah, 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 nah. We're bringing them back. You've killed too many. That's going to make my life that much harder. <sighs> Just being hard on yourself. I always say you shouldn't be hard on yourself, but since when did I ever take my own advice? That's right. Never. And... choking you out. <laughs> How many left? Twelve! Twelve left. I don't think this one has enough. I don't think this one's going to finish us off. But we'll get as many as we can. Am I going to get spotted here? No. Excellent. Choked out! Let's see, what's that new yellow circle? The one on my back? Well, the number, important number there is the one on the right. The right now says nine. That's how many orbs we need to get to open the door. So if we can get nine more orbs, we can get the hell out of this area. Okay. There should be a save point over here, and I want that. No, 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 don't turn tonight! Don't turn tonight! No, 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 no! No, it turns off the save orbs! No! Turns off the save point at night. Come the fuck on. Let's see, I love this game. It's like if you set a real great sci-fi horror inside a graphics card demo reel. You know, that's a good way to put it. I like that a lot. Yeah, talk about saving money and time. Unfortunately! I haven't mentioned this before because I didn't want to be too much of a downer, but unfortunately, it didn't really work. And here's what I found out, is the company that made this game 
they went out of business after making this game and nothing else. And basically implied on Twitter that this game never actually turned a profit. Which is super duper unfortunate because I kind of like this game a lot. And would have liked to see more from a creative studio like this. But no, it, uh, the studio's gone. Oh jeez, it got spotted still? Ow. <laughs> the Empress it isn't? You're very enthusiastic and I don't entirely understand it. Just to here, they don't know how to use doors this second, so I close that behind me. That's a nice thing at least. Outrun this one, and choke her out from behind. Let's see, do they self-publish or something? I think they self-publish. Or on Steam, at least, they're listed as both the developer and the publisher, so I think they would have had to. And yeah, there was not great marketing on this game. Good, I think I got spotted. Oh god, there's two of them there! Or one of them just was a little more clever than I expected. And here's night time, which means I can vault. They don't know how to vault, and so they're not going to learn right this second. That's a good thing. Is there an elevator back here? I don't see one. Unless this is an elevator. It's not. It's not. Need to find another elevator. The sooner the better. Real dark, though. Okay. Get the hell out of there. Oh, jeez. Alright, let me catch up on chat a little bit. Seeing good games fail hurts. See Kingdoms of Amlar. Yeah, that's another one that stings. A lot of passionate people in that studio, and it wasn't anything that had to do with the game that sunk it, so that is really unfortunate. Yeah, that the way it keeps zooming in on her is what gets me. The way it just keeps getting closer and closer. It's almost claustrophobic, so I do, do like that. Shurgle! Oh god, there's an emote name right there. Shurgle. The cutest little death god of them all. Little Shurgle. Our disease little pal, little Shurgle. Yeah, for being these huge areas, it does feel really claustrophobic, it's true. You're getting choked out. <laughs> Thank you for the schloop. Alright. We just need an elevator. That's it. We just need to find an elevator. There's one over there, but I think that's the central elevator, so we don't want that one just yet. Some water, I don't want to teach them to go through there. Oh, dang it, there's one right there. Yeah. Oh, there's an elevator. Here is one. I don't think it's the central one either. Let's find out. Oh, if I might share some thoughts, please go right ahead. All right, there are some over here. Cool. Let's see if we can finish this off then. We've only got... We only need nine more. This platform will probably have enough. That's a dead end. Am I going the wrong way? I don't see any orbs over here. I am going the wrong way. Shoot. What is this? Some kind of chat room? <laughs> hey, Panda Jim, welcome in. Oh, shoot. Oh, I got the takedown at least. Oh, that was really close. Sure, sure. Go ahead, Jess. I don't know anything about that topic specifically, so I'd love to hear about it. Please do. Can I jump down here? I can't. Should I jump down here? I don't know. But I've already done it. A few more to go. Close now. We're real close now. Let's play it safe. I don't want to die again. spot me back here no she is not and that means she gets choked out 
awesome. Let's see, this feels like Assassin's Creed 1 to me. It's a game that, you know, I, I yeah, I can get behind it. Like how Assassin's Creed 1 felt in a lot of ways like a proof of concept to me. I can get behind that. They don't know how to use doors to cycle, so that's fine. That's enough. All right. The pillar is open. We just need to get back. Oh, it's not even that far away. Let's see if we can get over there. Well, you can see me, but I don't think you can vault. No, they can't vault, so they can't get to me. That's good. So here's my thoughts about Assassin's Creed 1. I've talked about it before, but I am perfectly happy to refresh. The thing is, Assassin's Creed 1, I think, is great as a proof of concept. And that's about it. I think the thing is, it, it's got the skeleton of a good game, but there's a lot of things that aren't very polished about it. In particular... In particular, the fact that there's... They start reusing sequences at the halfway point. I think that's where it loses me. Alright, is there a save point over here? Please tell me there's a save point over here. I desperately need one. No? No, I don't see one. Alright, let's just head for the central pillar then. Oh, there, here's one. Oh, good, we're saved. Alright. Catch up on chat a little bit. Yeah, I enjoyed Assassin's Creed 1 until the halfway point when it started repeating assassinations, and then I dropped it. And for a long time, I thought that just meant that I don't like Assassin's Creed. And then some very good friends, who are very cool, convinced me to play Assassin's Creed 2, and I loved the shit out of that one. Um, Assassin's Creed 2 is such a quantum leap forward, and such a good demonstration of how you can take what's wrong about a game design and then fix it. And I love that. Also, I just noticed that my camera's not in the right place. I'm going to have to fix that. <laughs> I can't believe I'm just now noticing that. I never fixed that from the last game. And yes, Spinach, you are correct. The save points are not active at night, which has screwed me a couple times. Yeah, yeah, basically that's it, Quasinim. The game goes a little... I, um, I don't want to judge until over it, but I can definitely see the game getting a little bit repetitive. But there is absolutely the germ of a brilliant idea in here. And it breaks my heart that it isn't getting developed anymore. All right. Gotta get down to the central, oh geez. Gotta get down to the central pillar. And then we can get out of here. And then we get a new area, and I like that. I can hear clones using save point or using doors. I don't like that. What are we gonna do? Keep working our way over there. Jump down. We just taught them how to do with that, but that's fine. I think I'm okay with it. Jump down here. Let's use this save point. And, ah, oh shoot, can we get through here? Nope. We're going to teach him how to go in the water. That's unfortunate. But I think this is right where we need to go. Okay. This is the one. All right. Let's see. I think the main thing is there's not really puzzle design after it teaches you the day-night cycle with the water room. And it stops force, uh, kind of stops forcing you to use a particular action. That's true. So you're never like forced, but you're always. I think the nice thing is it's always teasing. I mean, you've always got the gun, and as long as you're grabbing upgrades, excuse me, you're constantly getting closer. You're, you're constantly getting more powerful in the things you can do. You're, you've got tons of ammo at this point. Five shots. That's a lot. So you're always tempted to use the gun, but it's also a terrible idea to do so. And I think that's interesting that it keeps doing that. Riding that razor's edge is pretty cool. 
You know, Rose, I, I never actually played Sticks because I get worried about stealth games. But I saw you, I think I, you were the one I actually saw playing some of it. It did look pretty neat. All right, so these elevators get us closer to the core of the planet-ish where we're trying to go. So this is actually big progress in the game. So we'll see how close it gets us. Let's see, you get very good at navigating without teaching them moves. You do eventually get the hang of it, it's true. And if you teach them nothing, they're not super dangerous. Agreed, agreed. Yeah, no, believe me, I played a little bit of Six one and I did not do well at it. Let's see, what if you use gun when lights are on? Then on the next cycle, all of the clones have guns. And they'll just shoot at you all the time. You've been descending for almost two hours. Holy shit! 339 kilometers. We're getting close. Dude, we're getting very... 339! Can we get an updated count? Wow, alright. <sighs> Look at this! Look at this! My god! It's gorgeous! Alright, we've got an objective marker all the way over there. That's going to take some doing to get to, I suspect. Let's see. Shane, did you complete Boktai? I did not. We're one stream away from beating it, but I put it on the back burner so I can do a little bit of off-stream grinding. Um, and I don't know when I'm going to get around to it, but we will. Let's see. If you find more tuning forks, is the between chapter text less... I hadn't actually thought about that. I've seen tuning forks before, but I've been afraid to hit them because I didn't want to draw attention to myself. But that might be a thing we could do. I know there are some options in this game. Let's see, careful that much gold to bring smog around. Oh, that son of a bitch. That son of a bitch. I don't want to mess with him. I know his weakness, but that doesn't mean I want to do it. Is this near Automata? Yes. People asked me to stream near Automata, so now I'm doing it. This is me streaming near Automata. You're welcome. Every one of you, you are welcome for me streaming near Automata right now, which is what we're doing. All right. Oh no! I didn't expect her to turn around like that. Unfortunate. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Oh no! We need to swarm here. Oh no! Come on! And now I'm toast. Oh, now I'm toast! Ah, oh, dang it. That booty! You can't see that booty. Not enough existential sadness? How much do you need? How much existential sadness do you need? Way too much color? Not a fan of Nier. I know the levels aren't uh, very attractive, but I think uh, gameplay-wise and storyline-wise, it looked really neat. I would definitely like to play it at some point. Chenenen, welcome in! How are you doing today? Excuse me for just a moment. I got something in my eye there. I want to pick it out and not make you guys watch it. So, give me just a second. That out. I'll take care of it. Then we'll get back in there. So this this area basically just seems like kind of a maze, in the sense that I've got to pick my way through these platforms while I keep getting closer to the objective. We've got our objective marker. We know where we're going. We can see it. We just don't have a path straight there. Is the problem. So how are we going to get there? I'm not 100% sure. Hey, hey, Bread! Bread, it has been a while. How have you been? How have things been in the land of... Where was I going with that? In the land of yeast? Yeah, let's go for that. In the land of yeast. Bread, I hope everything has been well. It is good to see you as always. Probably loafing about... There we go. I wish I was that clever. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Rose nailed it. Rose, Rose gets the points. Hey, bread is risen. There we go. That's a good one, too. <laughs> My bread are in. Bread, it is always a pleasure to see you. All right. Game is back on. Let's get going. I was going to jump down there, but that also seems super dangerous. 
I got spotted, shit. I'm getting spotted from every direction. This went badly. This went badly and I regret everything. Oh, no, get up. All right, we're trying a new route. We are trying a new route. Oh, jeez, this isn't gonna go well either. All these clones are super synchronized and I don't like it. I gotta fight this one off. Puns are the best thing since sliced bread. Don't slice bread. I don't think you'd like that. I don't think you'd care for that at all. All right. All right, we've lost our pursuers. Let's take it a little slowly. Oh, oh so close, Husketeer, so close. You hacked it up. Oh no, there's two of them up here. What the heck? Why are there two of them? Now, at least the staircases aren't shifting or anything, but oh, they're synchronized. There's no clean way through here, it looks like. I'm gonna see if I can choke one out and then I'll just push the other one down. It's not perfect, but it's something. No, I. No, oh, nope. Alright, I don't think they attack when I'm choking out for some reason. But I'll take that. Push you down. Alright. Then I'm going. Oh my gosh, Quaz. I wanna see that. Alright, you get pushed down. Now we're running. Oh my god, there's so many enemies in this section. There's just so many. I don't think they can find a way down here though, so that's something at least. Dark cycle. And we're making good progress, I think. Oh, that is horrifying. Hey, Dr. Belvin, welcome in. How are you doing today? Hope you're doing well. And John, you got the four. Nice. I approve. Oh, there's no direct way across. Shoot. That looks like where I'm going. We gotta go back up again. This is a long and complex level. But we're getting closer. I think. Don't see anybody up here. That's a good thing. And there's an orb. I'll take that. Catch up on Shed a little bit. Let me see. I gotta know who is the origin of Woohoo Hoo beyond just Blur Song number two, but what's but Blur Song number two is so good. Is that all you need? I don't think you need anything else. Imagine going to work, patrolling room with staircases, and still can't figure out how to get around the place. Oh, that'd be unfortunate. Or find the bathroom. We still haven't seen any bathrooms here. I'm just starting to think that the clones don't need to poop. I'm starting to think maybe pooping's not a thing they need to do. Oops. You're dead. Can I jump down here? Can. Oh, we're close. We are close. I think we can get there, actually. No, I got spotted. Shoot. Nope. Oh, shoot. No, not when I'm so close. Not when I'm so close. Don't come for me now. Don't stop me now. Oh, God. Oh, shoot. We're so close. All right, night cycle. Oh, we can do a night cycle. Oh, no, I got grabbed. Shoot, 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 shoot. All right, we're fine there. Oh, no. I have to redo the whole area. I have to redo the whole area. <sighs> this 
close. This close. Oh, that's brutal. What if they don't use the facilities because you haven't shown them how Shane, you monster? I, why haven't I need to use the facilities? I've been here for like half a day. Am I just pooping in my suit? Is this like an astronaut suit and I'm just pooping in it? Can they not see me pooping and that's how they're not learning how to poop? Or do they have the suits too? Maybe they're just pooping in their suits too. Maybe everyone's pooping in their suits. Maybe everyone's running around in poop suits. That could be a thing. Yeah, spinach, they learned how to jump down, unfortunately. That's a little scary and I don't like that. That's a little scary. Oh, that is a scary uh, a thought there, Jess, that there's time dilation going on as well. <laughs> oh my goodness. Why don't you use the facilities? Spite! Spite! Steel suit, there you go, that's what I was trying to think of. Old school Hogwarts. That's possible, maybe there's a, maybe in the elevator there's a place to poop, that could be a thing. <laughs> All right. Ah, oh, we were so close there. We were so very close there. I think we're gonna keep jumping down though, because even though I don't like teaching you that, it makes my life so much easier. Nope, I got spun. Being able to jump down makes this so much faster, so I think we're gonna have to let them learn that. There's no way around it. Yeah, yeah. Push down. I should have been patient here, because now I'm not gonna get the choke. Maybe? No, I am gonna get the choke. Cool. That's handy. Alright. We're still going. Down. Night cycle coming up. Alright. We can do that. We can do that, I guess. Rare naked choke for the win. There we go. Need to conserve some of my energy here. I don't mind using a little bit. Alright, I think we're in a good place. Have you accepted Tony Hawk as your lord and savior? What is even going on with that? I missed the Tony Hawk joke. The boss makes a dollar, the boss makes a dime. That's why I poop on company time. <laughs> I love it. Push you down. Alright, we're close again. We are real close again. We gotta make the most of this. Playing out basically like it did before. Can we do this better this time? I hope so. I hope so. Oh, I think we can make it. We choke out this one. We shove the other one. Come on, come on. Elevator. Mmm. Apex! Hey! Keep on keeping on! Apex, thank you for the two-month resub! I don't know why they didn't play this out, but I appreciate that, Apex! How are you doing today, Apex? And thank you so much for the support. Oh, jeez. Night cycle on the elevator. This is a long elevator, too. It's a super-duper long elevator. Okay. Ooh! Alright! And leads to another area like this. But we got a save at least. We did get a save. Catch up on Shed a little bit right there. Apex, that's really cool of you. Thank you for that. Just waiting for the snow to hit. You excited for the snowstorm? God, no. I told, I'm told there's not going to be a lot of uh, accumulation. But yeah, it's going to be a nasty snowstorm while it's happening. Oh, jeez. Got some new tricks? I don't think so. I don't think we accumulate any new tricks in the game, but I... Oh, uh, they just learned how to use the elevators. <laughs> Your nephew's got fake poop? I never understood. Who, who is it that enjoys getting that as a gift? I don't understand that. 
I just call him like I see him, bro. Is, is this is this a retribution for all the puns I throw in your chat? I assume it is. <laughs> oh, there are five. I guess that makes sense. All right. So we've got no objective marker. I'm not sure where that is, but it's way down there. But right now, we're quiet. So let's see if we can keep it that way. Let's see if we can keep this nice and quiet. All right. We're going to a night cycle already? Possibly. Go ahead and take this guy out. Hey, Emperor, good morning to you as well. How are you doing today, Emperor? I get to use the door without the learning how to do it. That's awesome. I like that. See an upgrade over here, too. Oh, but it's by a shoot, it's by a uh, door that I can't use. I can get over I can get to the upgrade over here. That's good. Alright, Ink Slime, welcome in. How are you doing? Hope you've been doing well. What were you playing today, Ink Slime? I saw what it was and I thought that was cool, but I didn't stop over there. I hope you're doing good, Ink Slime. I hope you're enjoying what you were playing. Oh, that's so weird. Yeah, I'm, I'm working on switching my notifications to a new service because for some reason a lot of the sound has been playing and that sucks and I don't like it. But I apologize to anybody that uh, subs and they don't get that noise because everyone who subs deserves more fun sound. Like that, that's what you deserve when you sub. Emperor, thank you so much for the gift sub to Hey Bread right there. <laughs> Bread, you know how it works. No one escapes. The gaze of Emperor's amazing generosity. Emperor, thank you for gift sub number 220. That's breathtaking. And hey, Bread, enjoy the 25-month resub right there. You got those emotes back. You enjoy them, Bread. You deserve them. Let's see. Can you imagine if your gun just ended the night like that? That was pretty, yeah, that was pretty badass. I was actually worried there, Jess, that it was going to insta-resurrect that uh, clone. I'm glad it didn't. Oh yeah, you're playing Temtem! How are you enjoying Temtem Ink Slime? I kind of think I'm going to end up buying Ink Slime eventually. Or Tim Tem Tem. <laughs> buying Ink Slime, sorry. I think I'm going to end up buying Temtem eventually because that looks like it would be right at my alley. But I hope you're enjoying it so far. <laughs> Bread has risen. I love it. Alright, this area is big. We got to be careful. I don't know where this one's going. There's a lot of enemies over here too. I don't think I have much cover here either. No, I do not have enough cover. Shoot, that didn't go well. Oh, I just accidentally used my uh, pulse power, which I keep forgetting I have. Really ought to remember I have that more often. It's handy. And choked out. There we go. It's a little dif difficult for me to see my HUD with all the white in here. That I'm not a super huge fan of. Because of all the white coloration and the light blue of my HUD, I can't see it very well. Oh shoot. Well, I made the upgrade at least. And then... Where am I going? Can I take the bridge? Take the bridge. I thought I saw a bridge. Bridge was over here. Shoot. Well, I know how to use bridges now. Hey, there's an elevator. Oh, this goes up. Shoot, I don't think I want to go up. Maybe? Oh, I want to go down. Yeah, I want to go down. Shoot. Alright, they know how to push and run away. For Unfortunately, they never just push me down. They always go for the kill. Oh god! I totally missed with that shot. That's unfortunate. But I can run now, too. Much faster response time on, t on uh, turning around slowly, I learned. Ever so slowly, I get better at these things. Where is my objective from here? I keep losing it in my head. I think I'm close though. 
Oh, this takes me to shoot. No, it's it's underneath me now. It is below me, so I need to find some way down from here. I think on the other side... Oh, shoot. I think on the other side there's a way. Oh, there's a save point over here, too. Shoot. Night time. Night time. There we go. Alright, now we just need to hang out. Until it's no longer nighttime and the save arch turns back on. Please? Will we get two shots left? Don't kill me. Okay. And we're saved. That's good. That's a little bit of progress right there. I also notice now I have two save markers, so I assume I need to get a key and then go back there. <sighs> Shane, I'll keep saying it every rare time I happen to get your stream, but yes, I'm still sad I don't get your streams like I used to and often wish I could hang out in your community more often. Well, I'll say like I always do, Brad. I hope with your new schedule, things are going really good for you. I hope your job is going good. I hope the weather is good out there. I hope your life has just been good. And we miss you, Brett. We certainly do miss you. But as long as you're doing good, as long as things are going okay for you, I'm going to be a happy camper. Hey, G Pudding, welcome in. I am doing good. I hope you're doing well as well. What's new with the Violet Clones? They're everywhere and they hate me. <laughs> All right, take care of yourself, Brett. You get a good rest. We will see you around. And uh, yeah, take care until we see you next. What a terrible night for a curse. It really is. Let's see, do they still learn stuff when it's dark? They do not. They do not. That's my time to be free. I can do whatever I want when it's dark and completely get away with it, but it's the only time I can do what I want and get away with it. Alright, I think I can jump down from here. I find the right spot. There we go. And there is the key. Alright. So I need to get that key, so at least we went to the right place. It always sucks when you go to the, uh... The place you need the key before you get it. Oh, I should have done the takedown shoot. That was bad. That was a mistake. All right, we got the scepter. Now we're leaving. Push it down again. All right. Now we got to figure out how to get to the next objective. Can we save with the key? That'd be cool. I enjoy that. Oh, I should have grabbed the energy back there. And now it's nighttime and I only got one shot. That's unfortunate. I don't even know if I want to save it. Oh, jeez. This one's got an orb. I kind of want this. There we go. Well, at least my one shot's be charging, so it's not like I don't have any. Yeah, let's save here. Let's do that. Schoolyard violence is the pushing. That is pretty amusing. Hey, you. You die. I mean, you know, murdering someone with an orb isn't really schoolyard. That's not the word I'd use, but yeah, I get you. Oh, okay. Oh, I didn't even see them there. All right, now we gotta move. Now we got no time. All right, let's... Do we want to use... No, we don't want to use the elevator yet, I don't think. Do want to be a little bit more stealthy than we are. I'm getting myself into trouble here. Oh, God, I'm getting spotted all over the place. Oh, it's right over here. Oh, it's right over here. I'm so close. Oh, there's two of them. Oh, shoot. I'm going to need another key. Let me drop this one off at least. And where's the other one, then? Do I have another objective marker? I don't see one. Oh, there is one. I see it now. Shoot, all right. We're going. No, shoot. Get off, get off, get off. All right. I can't see exactly... Oh, it's up there. All right. So now we got to get up a little higher. Maybe we can find one of those elevators now. 
Okay. There is an elevator. All right, cool. Throwing balls, pushing girls over, and hide and seek. I didn't even thought about it like that, but I love it. Is that what the subtitles said? What the hell? What even is that G pudding? I love it though. Shane, you went to a different school. <laughs> I'm pretty sure we all broke some sort of glass tubes on other kids during our school year. I don't remember that part, Trey Dog. You'd think I would. Well, welcome in, Trey Dog. How are you doing today? Oh, jeez. <laughs> all right. Go for the elevator here. Hopefully without attracting attention. I don't want anybody chasing me if I can avoid it. Looks like we're not far from the other key, so that's a good thing at least. Looks like it's actually pretty nearby. This may take me almost there. Oh, shoot. Go ahead. Got a little bit of energy. Oh, there's an orb over here. And you're choked out. Let's see. Today's starting to replay through Kenshi. What's Kenshi, Dr. Belvin? I'm not sure if I've heard that one. But I'm always down to hear about games I was unaware of. Maybe that's why I repress the memory that's possible. You're dead. What's on that platform over there? Oh shoot, that means I gotta extend it. That could get tricky. Dead. This orb. Oh, I'm attracting way more attention than I'd like here. Oh, I can vault, and they can't learn that now. I like that part. Extend this one. You're dead. Excellent. And... Alright, I got the scepter. Carrying it around, that's rude. Okay. Our objective is below us. Go ahead and call the elevator. Take that down there. Oh, yeah, learn to pick up the scepter. I hate it when they do that. Oh, no, I got spotted. Oh jeez, all right, this will fully restore my gun energy. That'll be nice. Then I can visit some violence on these fools. There we go. Uh, where's my objective? Over this way? All right, let's head over this way. Sorry, I keep running, falling behind on shit. All right, let's see. Kenshi is a game where you do whatever and whatever means death. All right, that's a detailed description. As you can see, it's a sandbox RPG where you have the option to build a large squad of guys and build set. You know, I think I might have seen that one on Steam before, and I was kind of curious. Are you liking it so far, Belvin? Are you enjoying it? <laughs> you having fun with subtitles there, G-Pudding? I think the subtitling software I'm using, I think, is very accurate for the most part. I think the problem is just when you get into a video game, you use a lot of unique terms that it isn't necessarily going to know how to translate very well. Also, I'm very mush mouth. A lot of that I will put on myself. Let's see. At the start, we got a dog. Nice. Good popo. All right. It's, uh, it's a bit far. Oh, no. I'm coming down in an elevator right there. Choke you out. Maybe we get spotted from behind though. Oh, maybe not. Maybe not. That's cool. Alright. I can just get through here. Oh, I'm so close. I'm so close now. Come on, go! Go through the door! Through the door! Oh, sweet! Oh, that was too close for comfort, but we made it. Oh, we made it. 
Ho 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 ho! Waiting for the computer to see me do the choke out. Choke out! We're stuck in choking animation! Luckily, they don't seem to attack me while I'm choking out. Sometimes you see them crouched, like ready, cat like, but they don't actually attack me. Oh god, Rin, is there any greater feeling of release than the great weight being lifted off your shoulders as you see the autosave happening? <sighs> okay. Okay. We've got another objective marker immediately, too. Technically, I didn't see an autosave marker, but I assume we got an autosave, because when you go through a door, usually there is one. I'm hoping we're good. Oh, it's still a long way to the next point. Which is unfortunate. We're getting closer. Oh, you did see it, Rin. Awesome. Oh, that's good to hear. That is good to hear. Can I jump down here? It looks like a long way down. Oh, I can make it. And I think this is the way we need to go, too. So cool. Cool, cool, cool. Head through here. And what do we got back here? Ooh, there's an exit! There is an exit, which number one means I'm going to be safe for a little bit, and number two means we're going to get some more storyline. Both of these are excellent, and I love them. Oh, that's good. Oh, that's good. Jade is going to the tunnel at the end of the light. If it's the other way around, you got to be worried, but I think this way it's okay. I think. Ooh, the water? Is there water here? Oh, that's weird. What's going on in here? All right. Creepy, but it's it's empty at least. Still no echoes in here, so I like that. Or the gun barrel hallway, basically. Matrix service tunnels? I always think of them as the backstage areas of Portal. N, I have to know why you are doing this. You don't owe him anything. He hunted you down and brought you back against your will. He died trying to help me. That's so wonderfully naive. Foster. Well, he truly doesn't give a shit. I think that's his reason for doing it. The long halls are clocking in time to distance him from life, relations, everything. Well, I was there. Alright, so London, our AI quote-unquote friend, doesn't actually think that Foster was trying to rescue her. I've been selfish to let you go this far. You deserve to know the facts about Foster. He was his job. That's why I'm sure he didn't try to help you that night. If he did, it must have been for another reason than what you think. I really wish I wasn't right. As we became friends, I used to hope that he would stop. That he would want life again. But he never did. I know exactly what he was. But you don't know me at all. You're not the first Grant sent to get me. I saw them all coming, biding my time, waiting for the one who could set me free. That was Foster. Cold and detached, nothing to lose. The perfect candidate for Gramps to trust. But I could wake him up from his slumber. That's what I do. I get in. I push people's buttons. What are you talking about? I figured this was on him. He chose his line of work, this job in particular. I never had a choice. My life was decided centuries before I was even born. He was good, Foster, but I was better. He saw me and felt sorry for me because I designed it to be so. Showed him strength, showed him weakness. Ultimately, showed him trust. He didn't stand a chance against me. No one really does. Wow. I don't gamble, because I've always already won. 
Wow, all right. That's interesting. That's very interesting. Uh, let me catch up a little bit. Trust nobody, not even yourself. I love that one. Reminds you of some parts of Horizon. I still need to play that. Oh, my God. And Rin, I think we're much closer to the end from that. Because I think when they said 320, I think that was the distance we traveled. Excuse me, I think we're in the double digits from the core now. I could be wrong, though. Hopefully we'll find out pretty soon. Yeah, so she was playing, uh, she was playing Foster there. Are we the baddies? <laughs> I hope not, but welcome in. Yeah, the game is not that long. I think we're going to finish it tonight, hopefully. Let's see, ask you here, what is the, uh, what is the beginning story of this game? Yeah, well, absolutely, always ask, always ask. So what happens is... Um, we are on this mysterious planet that uh, factors into the main character N's religion. That cube on her back, she believes, contains the soul slash life force of somebody that tried to rescue her. And she's hoping if she gets to the bottom of this place, she'll be able to resurrect him. And that's basically the story we've got so far. <laughs> oh no, Jess. Hi, Nightbot. I'm not, totally not, but... Definitely, it sounds like N was a manipulator here. I don't blame her. I don't blame her because I'm not sure there was any other way out of her situation, but... She definitely had some manipulations Someone going. Wrong. My head sphere just triggered. What? Something's out here. What? There's not supposed to be anything out here. No, I'm supposed to be safe out here. What? I'm supposed to be safe out here. The hell is that? What the hell is that? I, what is that thing? I mean, it's not one of the echoes, but what is it? I've got to cross. No other way. Okay, so it looks like it's scanning that platform, but what does it mean? Is it gonna kill me if I go up there? Do I need to go up there? Oh! Whoa! Hello? I think it's lighting my way. What? Why? Okay. Helping me? What's going on with my HUD? That's the last thing I expected to find here. A maintenance device. Kindness. It's basic safety protocol. You were angry with me. Honestly, I think you're delusional. You didn't make Foster do anything. Resourcefuls always win. No matter the cost. Settling for anything else, even thinking it, is taboo. What do you want, N? You want me to declare my defeat? London, I need you to understand this. I understand that you're very confident. Confidence is a good thing. I lost mine once. Had a bad spell for a few decades. As you so correctly pointed out, I felt obsolete. That's when I met Foster. He convinced me that even a sword has its uses in an age of technology. Would you please hear me out? No. You listen. Foster was diving headfirst into the void, and I could do nothing about it. The only thing suggesting it could ever be any other way was that lighter. I'd see his hand tighten around it, or he'd whip it out to reassure himself it was still there. When I asked him about it, he said the lighter meant nothing to him. That was why he had it. He told me never to mention it again. He said it with such cold conviction. I knew he'd cut me off if I ever did. Then he gave it to you. The one noisy element to his calm. It was obvious that was his handle, and that you'd see it the same way. He didn't give it to me. I took it because I knew it would be my ticket here. That's how I operate. Why are you trying to turn me against you now? 
Foster got shot to give me the moment I needed to end Gramps. But instead of making me free, I realized that I'd come full circle. I'd been the perfect resourceful, manipulating all the pieces to secure my win. Never even questioning my right to be the winner. Because of me, Foster found himself in a situation where only one of us would survive, and it turned out to be the lesser one. The one willing to sacrifice the other. And now I'm doing it again. Coming here by forcing you, London. But I'm done with it. You deserve a choice. An honest one. It's not about the lighter anymore. Foster decided to help you. That means you did what I couldn't. You got him to engage. Since then, you've done everything in your power to undo the consequences. And if you hadn't been so smart about it, we wouldn't be here. If anyone can see this through, it's you. Now, could we be done with these endless confessions and get on with it, please? Yes, sir. That got heavy. Biddle man, welcome in. How are you doing today? Lone Grin, good to see you as well. Sorry, I'm getting a little behind on this. Yeah, ship's a dick, but so are we. So are we. <laughs> Foster's is Australian for beer. This is important. This is an interesting game. I'm loving this, Biddle man. I'm absolutely loving this. Really, really cool ideas in this game. I mean, Foster's like the central figure. I mean, he's not there, so I wouldn't say the story is about him, but it centers around him. He's very important to the narrative. He's the reason they're here. He's the reason they're together. So there is that. All right, it's a new area. I almost think we only need to find one more elevator before we get out. Sure, Jess, go right ahead. Complicated human interaction, oh my gosh. The shadow of where Foster used to be, that's good, I like that. This is Death Stranding before Death Stranding. It's a, there's a little bit in there. I can see it. Wait, what? Look, it's dead. Why is it dead? We've never seen one that's just dead before. They just get- They're killing each other again. But why? What? I have the cube. Gods know. Does clear the way. There's still some, but why are they killing each other? Did you see that? It's huge. And it's doing things I didn't teach it. Oh god. They're not killing each other, that gold thing is killing them. What the fuck is that? What is that gold clone? Okay, this is uh this is a twist. This is a twist I neither saw coming nor care for. We've got to make sure that thing doesn't spot us. If it does, we are in a lot of trouble. There's a bridge over here. Let's extend it and let's see if we can get the hell out of here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh no! Oh no! Whoa! Okay, so I can't shove the gold units. And I can't fight off the gold units. They are insta-kill. Wow, I tried to shove her. I did. It didn't work. Did you see that? Oh crap. And it's doing things I didn't teach it. That's not good. If I shoot it, then the clones are gonna learn how to shoot. I don't want that. I don't want any of the clones to learn shooting. Ever. Alright, we can mark it at least. 
catch up a little bit. <laughs> the golden boy, oh my gosh. The power of my stand is unstoppable. Jess, I've actually been working my way through JoJo's. Yeah, that thing solved a problem real quick now, didn't it? Oh god, they're getting better. As goes the weather up there. Oh yeah, she'll love that. Tall people love that, let me tell you. Oh, the clones can defend themselves then. I don't know, I haven't seen any of the clones attacking it. I just see it attacking the clones. <sighs> what if what, yeah, it's possible they learn to shoot the gold one, but I, like I said, I haven't seen any of them attacking. <sighs> yeah, I know I'm way behind on JoJo's, but eventually I get there. Eventually I'm getting some JoJo's in my life. Is it turning back? It's turning back this way. Shoot. Alright, we're gonna take this nice and slow. We're not gonna rush this. Except now we're rushing it. Come on, bridge. Come on, bridge. Okay. Okay, we're across. I didn't get a prompt to retract it, but it's fine. We're good. We're golden. No, it's not literally golden. We're out of there. Bad choice of words. Oh, hey, an upgrade. And now I've got six triangles. That's awesome. Okay. We got a new objective as well. Oh, hey, Eric, director. Welcome in. How are you doing? How's your weekend going? <laughs> Everything else is golden, so why not? Why did I pick that word? Why did I do that? Oh, that is a long way off. Alright, we're gonna have to be extra careful now. Because I don't know if there's more of those gold things, and I don't like that idea one bit. Oh, there is more of the gold things! Shit, there's one right there. You see, I'm not seeing the clones attack it. It's just attacking the clones. Oh, there's one right there! There's more than one! There's two of them, at least! Oh, God, the difficulty just spiked, ladies and gentlemen. I don't even know if the orbs will work on them. Oh, I can't pull out my gun, so I can't tag him now. Shoot. Oh, I can just hear it murdering them. I haven't taught the clones to be violent yet. They're always violent. They always try and murder me, at least. Oh, shoot. I got spotted by somebody. What? Oh, jeez. No, no. Oh, damn it. I tried to use the orb, nothing happened. Maybe, I don't know if I can even knock him down. I can hear murdering me, it's true. I'm doing good, Eric Director, thanks for asking. Oh, it's Oscar Sunday, that's true, that's true. Got any movies you're hoping are gonna win? Does this gold unit go for the clones or you first? That's a good question, Emperor. I don't think it's ever had a choice between them. Oh, but that is a good question. Damn it. Alright. Let's tag the gold units wherever we see them. Let's tag them and hopefully that'll help us track them a little bit. We might still be able to knock them down with the orbs. That's a possibility. There's an upgrade over there, but honestly, I don't think I care. I don't think I do. I think I'm fine. Oh god, it's coming. Oh god, that's upsetting. And 
I'm just gonna smash you, because I know that you can't use the orb on that thing. Think we need to go back upstairs, yes, maybe? Oh god, there's one right there. Oh god, there's one right there. Oh no, no, no! Oh god, we're dead. We're toast. There was no way I could have pulled up my gun there. <sighs> Let me catch up. Oh my god. Keep imagining the giant gold clones is Grace Jones! Oh my god. Might offend your Boy Scout sensibilities? I mean... We're already murdering lots of dudes in here, so <laughs> I think that's fine. Harvest receipt. Oh, did you spot that Husketeer? Yes. Oh, all right. Oh, God, that one right there. There's one up there, too. Shoot, there's so many now. I kind of want to try shooting them, but also, I just kind of fear interacting with them in any way, shape, or form. Look at how ter- oh my god, they're terrifying. It still looks a little bit like me. But also like some sort of horrifying clone. It's all twisted and messed up. Yeah, that was crap. I love Harvester. It's so good. Yeah, if you click on it, there's more information. Oh, God. Oh, shit! I think I got away with that. I think I actually got away with that. Oh, that's shasty and emojis. Oh, I got spotted. No! Dang it, I thought it was going to leap over. <sighs> Jess! Yeah, Harvester is just one of my, uh... It's a joyous game. You know what, here, we're going to test it out. I'm going to try shooting one of the bastards and we'll see what happens. Actually, let me see if I can choke one out. No. I can kill it, but it takes three shots. No. And gets their attention real fast. Okay. So, uh, shooting them is also a bad idea. 42 or 6 just ahead of you? Wait, what does that mean? I'm being bamboozled out of- Wait, does it say out of stock? Really? That's weird. Shouldn't do that. Oh, okay. <laughs> BRB modding this game to play Quad City DJs whenever- Oh my god. I can kill them! I can I mean, I don't have that much ammo. I've only got six shots to begin with. So I don't think bulldozing my way through here is gonna be the, the trick. Oh, that's weird, Husketeer. It should not do that. Headshots? I've never had a headshot an enemy before. No, I, it's not headshots because part of the description of the gun in this game is they said that the gun is always lethal. It actually specifies in the game's lore that even if you shoot someone in the pinky with this gun, it should kill them instantly. Well, I don't think headshots are the answer because they go against the game's lore. Let's move. Oh god, there's one right there. Let's turn around. Oh god, I hear him dying all over the place. Oh god, it lost track of me. Oh god, it lost track of me. Oh, it's so good. Oh, it's still hunting for me, but it lost track. There's 
two of them right there, though. That's upsetting. Is he gonna turn to night? Well, that's interesting. I think I'm gonna hide during night. Because they've got the advantage right now. Oh, but this will resurrect a bunch! This will get some distractions in here. Oh god, I'll come over here. I'll come over here. Replace the gold units with the Dwarven Dust Town Merchant? That'd get me in a murdery mood. I mean, wait, what? Alright, so the golden ones aren't super observant. It doesn't notice that clone right behind it. It's about to. Advance, but that thing is making me nervous. I can drop down here. Do that. Oh god, there's one right there. Nope, I can't pull up my gun now. Right, I think I need to hit up these stairs. Yep, we're making progress. This is progress. No save point or anything, but progress. And I'm just gonna smash you. This doesn't seem to be useful for anything else. Got a gold unit over there, let's tag him. Oh, I think we might be real close to where we need to get to. Super worried about this gold guy that hopefully he notices one of those clones and doesn't turn around this way! Oh, this could be a problem. Pitch up one shit. This isn't Star Trek, otherwise I could help. I appreciate that, Marksman. So how does the clone learning work? Alright, so basically anytime I do anything, they don't need to see me do it because the palace itself sees me doing it. Um, but supposedly I've heard if they see me doing it, it speeds up the cycles. And then when it goes dark, they can't see me doing anything, but when the lights come back up, they've learned everything that they saw me do in the previous cycle. Hey Tom, welcome in! This game is fascinating. I have never seen anything like this game. I am loving it so far. Can I get a shout out for Tom if we have any mods in here? I would appreciate that. How are you doing this weekend, Tom? Uh, the gold clones are killing off the black clones, but are the gold clones find you? Yeah, yeah, because the the noise of my gun is going to attract more enemies right there, and that is dangerous. Okay. I'm so close to getting out of this area. I just need to get past this guy, and then I think I'm in a good spot. I think I'm in a real good spot after this. Oh, it's about to turn night again? Strange, but okay. There's an elevator. Apparently we need to take. See that? Oh, game is super spoopy now, I can see that. Ladies and gentlemen, if you're not following Retrograde Tom, please take a moment to click that link and give him a follow. He's good people. Has an amazing stream. One of my absolute favorites on Twitch. Check him out sometime, you might enjoy him as well. And I just got an autosave, thank goodness. Oh, I am good, Tom. I had a good weekend. It wasn't as productive as I'd hoped, but uh, I'm enjoying the heck out of this game. This is a wild ride. Yeah, slam, oh my gosh. That level was stressful. Level was stressful and we're not done yet. I don't see any bad guys here yet, but that doesn't mean they're not here. Oh, not through there. Don't see anybody here yet. Honestly, it's just making me more nervous. Where is everybody all of a sudden? 
I don't know. Yeah, the skull doors are gorgeous. And the fact that sometimes they uh, oh, try to kill you is very weird. Uh, yeah, this is this is nerve wracking. Oh my god, Shadow Lion, that would stress me out too much. I don't think my heart could take it. Alright, I see blue spheres up ahead, so it looks like we're gonna have to do some sphere collecting with gold robots around. Oh, I don't like this. Oh, I don't like the sound of that at all. Oh, this is upsetting. Oh, yeah, it, oh, it does. I don't know how, quite how they got that, because we activated the building using the cube. But it didn't get Foster's face, it got ends. So it is a good question, how did that happen? There's still a lot we don't understand about this. Oh, you're talking about the hypothetical VR, oh god. If it actually had like my face? Please no. If I can see Shane clones, that'd just be hilarious. Just a bunch of big, weird dopes wandering around. Alright, go ahead and refill my ammo, even though I've only got one. I don't think we're coming back this way anytime soon. She is chasing you! On her body! Alright, that'd be interesting. I mean, what? <laughs> okay, still not seeing any enemies, but there's gotta be some up here, right? Oh, I heard screaming. Oh, there's the, yep, yep, there's a gold one. Go ahead and tag you. Oh my god, how am I gonna do this with gold enemies? How in the hell can I possibly survive with them wandering around? I honestly don't know. I'm gonna take you down. You're a nice distraction, but also, you can kill me too. You don't discriminate, I understand this. Oh, somebody just died from nearby. There's a clone right there. Oh, there's a gold robot right there. We're gonna tag him. I don't know how many enemies I can have tagged at once. It'd be a good thing to know. Oh, he's coming back this way. Shoot. Luckily, their hearing sucks! How many do I need? I need 30 still? 29? Oh god, that's a lot. I need a lot of spears here. 35 to start, oh my gosh. This is gonna be challenging. <sighs> Let's see, what are these new guys? Jindraj, welcome in the gold ones already have a full suite of knowledge. They can do a whole bunch of things, including run, without me teaching them and they don't appear to forget anything. Um, also, they take three shots to kill and uh, kill regular clones on their own. They just wander around murdering regular clones. It's horrifying. <sighs> all right, all right. What are we at now, 20, 29 still? 29 still. I have an upgrade. Turn into nighttime. That'll be good in the sense that it'll add some distractions. I don't think I want to move at night. It's too dangerous now. Gold ones could be anywhere. <sighs> yeah, Gamma I'm getting stressed out too. Do we know the reason why the gold clones are killing off the black clones? I don't know. I've got a suspicion, Shadow Lion. But I don't know for certain. I have a theory, but I don't know. Right behind me. Oh, there's one right there. Shoot. Oh, God. 
All right, here's another gold one. Oh, don't come this way. Please don't come this way. All right, turn it around. That's good. I like that. It's right there. Oh, motherfuck. Oh, I don't care for this one bit. I'm just gonna slip across here if you don't mind. This is so spooky. If this guy notices me, I'm dead and I lose all my progress. Oh, that's the, that's the hardest part about this area. It's so easy to lose a mountain of progress. And I don't really see any way around that. All right, how what, what are we at? Twenty-two. We got to get up those stairs. No two ways about that. Jesse found the later segments vexing. I could see that. I could see this part getting vexing. Yeah, definitely. That's a word I'd use. Oh, there's still another one down there. Shoot, can I get to that? Really like to get to that so we don't come back. Dangerous though. Make sure we get as many in this one area as we can. There's an elevator over here too. That's cool. Grab that. There's one at the top of the stairs, so I think we are gonna take the stairs still. Why does someone look like they stabbed you in the back of the cube? That is our buddy! That is a buddy of ours that we're trying to resurrect. How are you doing, Freyas? How's your weekend going so far? Let's take a quick jog up here. Right behind this. Okay, we're doing okay here. Pretty good, just woke up. Well, good morning. Welcome in. Okay. What do we got? 20, 20 left. Hopefully we can find a save arch somewhere. But that's definitely not a guarantee. The fact that there's clones up here suggests there may not be a gold enemy up here. And if that's the case, that's awesome. Give me a little bit of room to work. Choke you out. Gonna open the door. I really don't want to teach these guys anything, but also... I just gotta get this done. Here's a save arch! Oh, sweet, sweet save arch. Alright, so our is saved. Oh, that feels good. That makes That takes a lot of stress off my shoulders. Let's see. Let's see, Homek assignment is to care for the cube for the week. You know we never did that in my Homek. We did a lot of stuff in Homek, but we never had to care for the baby. Does anybody else have to do that? Is that a thing that's still done in Homek? Having to care for the little baby doll? I'm legit curious about this. If that's still around, or if it's sort of fallen out of favor. Let me know. All right, there's more above me. I can see some more up there. Oh, and I got an orb, so I can't tag him. Shoot. No! 
Oh god! Alright, we saved recently. It's fine. It's fine. <sighs> we didn't lose that much progress because we saved recently. That's okay. Okay. We're still at... 19. Still at 19. Halfway there. Let's see. The Cube is in the film? I love the movie Cube. That was really awesome. Freya, you never had home ec. Gamagumo, you never had to do that. Rin, you had a bag of flour. You made cookies. I think you won. I think you might have won there. I've seen those. They were Now that I'm thinking about Trade Dog, they had those in my school, but it wasn't in core home ec. There was like a parenting class and it was an elective. And I didn't take that, so I never had to take care of the babies. But I remember now, that was a thing. Just not in the class I- Oh god! Wasn't paying attention there. I think I might want to kill that gold one. It'll take three shots and it'll make a lot of noise, but... It feels like it's kind of isolated. It feels kind of isolated, so I might be able to get away with it. That's a dangerous thing to say, but I might. Let's try it. Over here. Oh, and I yelled. I shouldn't have done that. Pressed the wrong button. I tried to reload. Oh, no, shoot. Yeah, that attracted a lot of attention. Holy crap. And now it's night. I got spotted, didn't I? Shoot. And I'll run it again. Oh god. Somebody get killed nearby. Tagged another gold one. Oh jeez. There is the knockdown function, but I still have to pull the gun out to use it. So there is a delay in being able to use that on anybody. And that's what's dangerous. You got the takedown, that's cool. Yeah, I can't I can't snapshot right there. Alright, 13! 13 and there's some more down here. That's gonna attract some attention. In oh god, they learned how to shoot! They learned how to shoot, I made a mistake. And I got shot down. Holy shit! Alright, so I don't- I shouldn't shoot. I really shouldn't shoot, that's too dangerous. I, I would love to kill that gold guy, but the fact that they can learn to gun me down is just too much. Oh my god. That goldie shot me down. God damn! I shot me down, oh my god. But yeah, that's basically it. We're, our, the cube is our buddy, we want to resurrect our buddy. And for some reason, we think at the bottom of this maze, if we can get there, we can resurrect him. That's what we're trying to do. Get all the way to the bottom. Oh, he's gonna come back this way though, isn't he? No, not yet. Oh, eventually he's going to turn around and that's going to be a problem. Oh, we saw another clone. Cool. Ah. Alright, we might be able to do this. Yeah, we don't really know. The sphere is part of my suit. So that's just a sort of built-in function. The rest, I, I, I couldn't tell you. 
There's a lot of mystery in this game, and we haven't gotten a lot of answers yet. Alright. It's still moving away, cool. We have all these. Oh, there's another gold one over there, shoot. And him. No! Alright, there's a couple more over here. I'd like those. Don't see any gold robots in the immediate vicinity. See if I can stealth kill this guy. I would very much like that. Yes! Possibly! Alright. There was a gold robot relatively nearby. It was a little upsetting. There's a way up here without vaulting. I kind of don't want to teach them vaulting. If I can avoid it. Shoot, I got spotted by somebody. Who is it? It's a gold robot! I don't know if they know how to operate doors. Ah. Alright, that one got distracted. That's a wonderful thing. Huh. Oh, that was real close. That was real close. Oh, okay, okay. Let's hide over here for right now. Especially since there's a gold robot looking right over here. Oh no, it's coming this way, cool. I don't even know if I'm fully hidden. I think I am. I'm not 100%. Oh god, no, please, please, please! No! Alright, I need to, I need to main vault up here. Oh, this is real bad. Got too much attention! Oh, there's a gold one! Alright, the gold one got distracted! That was so lucky! Oh my god, I need a breather here. This is so tense! Yeah, this is a very stressful game, Jess. Holy shit! <sighs> Maybe if you didn't have a giant flashlight activated, you don't seem to be able to see the light, so that's a good thing at least. Lava jokes, welcome in! What do you call a shepherd that's always cutting costs? A sheepskate! The sheer nerve! Literally the worst. Oh my god. Your hand stretches might be a good thing. Honestly, it's my shoulders. Oh, it's my shoulders are the bad thing. Got a lot of stress hanging around in there. Holy shit. Oh, take some deep breaths. All right, what are we down to? We've only got six. We've only got six more. Yeah. I can see some nearby. gonna be tricky. Hear the sounds of killing. Don't know where they're coming from. Oh, there's a gold robot all the way down there. A few more to go. <sighs> I haven't tagged this one yet. Can't see him through walls. There we go. He's tagged. Cool. Oh, there might be enough blue orbs down here. What do I need? Five? 
I need five. No, 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 no! Oh, God. Oh, God, that's bad. Oh, God, that's bad. I'm attracting all kinds of attention. I don't want any of it. Can I hide out in here for a sec? Alright, good. I think I lost him. Choke this guy out. Alright, Gamagoomo, you're gonna peace out. Thanks for hanging around with us, Gamagoomo. I hope you had a good time. And we will see you around. Take care of yourself. Oh my god, I'm so close. Gold robot's still hanging around over here. That's not good. Get something in between him and us. <sighs> Why do I have cool whip hair? Oh, cool whip hair. That I don't know either. That I could not tell you. Everybody be real quiet. Nobody breathe. Oh god, don't turn around. Turn around. Don't turn around. Turn around. Don't turn around. He turned around, but he didn't see us. Oh, now he saw us. It's nighttime. It's nighttime. I can get away with shit. Now the question is, do the gold ones get resurrected at night? Yes, they do! The gold ones still get resurrected at night. That's awful. That is the friggin' worst. I was hoping maybe I could permanently kill them, but nope. Nope, they're just gonna keep coming back. I got that one tagged, at least. Oh, I need to sneak down here. I need to start moving down this way. There's no way around it. I need to get farther down here. One way or another. Choke you out. No! No, I pressed the wrong button! I tried to choke him up, but I pressed E. Oh no! Oh no, I'm getting all kinds of attention. Shoot! No! All that progress! Oh, all that progress! How do I set my spawn? I need to sleep. Don't worry, we'll still be here when you get back. Oh, Shane is sad. That's a lot of progress lost. That is frustrating. I need to keep moving this way though. Moving up is our best get is our best hope. I do think this is the path forward. Cool whip my hair back and forth. Oh my gosh. I don't have this guy tagged. Tag him too. Can we go upstairs maybe? Oh, there's so many down here though. I don't want to give up on those. I really do want to get these right here. But it, oh no, I totally got an Ultron vibe. I'm glad it wasn't just me. Yeah, I was thinking Ultron when I saw those too. It's the it's the face mask, I think, or the helmet, or whatever you want to call it. That's what's getting the Ultron feels from me. Oh, I hope I'm properly hidden here. I don't know that I am. Careful. Careful. And now we walk. Now we're walking. We're gonna go around this way. Oh god, alright. We got that. The glowing eyes and mouth, that'll do it. That will do it. Kinda wanna... No, this elevator goes down. We don't need to go down. Shoot. 
Yeah, we could jump down here too, but that's not going to get us anywhere either. We need to get across this bridge. What are we at right now? 15! 15! We lost a ton of progress there. That is really unfortunate. But we are still progressing. I'm going to make a break for it here. Hope I can get somewhere interesting before I die. I don't want to get spotted by that one, but I don't know where that gold one's going in a sec either. Now, see, I haven't played Dishonored 2 yet, see, see, I played Dishonored 1 and I loved the shit out of that game. What a good game. But I haven't played the second one yet. Alright, that's a kill. I like that. Grab the upgrade. I like that. See, that's another down elevator. Once again, we don't want to go down right now. Want to stay here or go higher if we can? Oh shoot, it's turning the night. Oh, that's not good. Oh, nothing about that is good. What does the upgrade do? If we get six of them, Freya, we get an extra bullet in our gun. Which, you know, isn't... Isn't everything, but it's nice. It is nice to have. Let's hide out here for a second. And let's choke this one out. Oh, we got the opportunity. There's a tiny bit of breathing room. Okay. Okay, gun's full. Got the guy over there who's stealthing around. I don't like that. Can live with that for the time being. Oh shoot, I didn't see there was a gold robot right there. Definitely missed that guy. Let's tag him. Holy shit. How'd he get so close? What am I at? I'm at nine! I am at nine. I want to get those two there, and then I need to head upstairs. That's our next goal. We want to get those two orbs, and then go upstairs. And there's two staircases we can do it at. I don't care which one we do. Either works for me. Tags might fall off when we reset. That's true. Yeah, we got so lucky there, Rin. Holy shit. All luck, no skill. I'm not ashamed to admit this. One of these. Right, he's behind a wall. We want to grab these and then we're going to head upstairs. What are we at? Seven. We need seven more. There's another gold robot right there. Oh, we're so close! Ah! I'm just gonna smash you with this. Ah. I don't even care. Luck and key! Oh my gosh. Oh, I got spotted by gold robot shit. I don't know how I got spotted by a gold robot, but I did. Oh no, it's coming this way. I don't even know if there might be others over here. Oh, it jumped down. It jumped down, cool. That'll give us a little breathing room. Oh, the noise! Right! I forgot that makes noise. Totally forgot that makes noise. Shit. Five more. Five more. Oh, it's coming this way. I don't want that. Oh, 
Oh, I really don't want that. Oh, there's clones everywhere now. It'll be a nice distraction, but also gold robots. so close! I don't even remember where the exit is either. So that's going to be a problem. But that's a tomorrow problem, not a today problem. That's a worry about it later kind of problem. Yeah, I guess tags don't fall off, so I'm not sure what happened there. Really need to get rid of this guy. Glad that other one didn't see me. I'm gonna take that. It's a win. I don't see where the gold robot went, so I'm gonna hope it jumped down. Hopefully. Three more. Three more. Two. One. Oh my god. Come on. I see a big elevator up ahead that might get us near the goal. Yeah. <sighs> okay. Okay, that opened the elevator. Which is above me. What? Oh god, no! We're running! That's fine! We don't have much of a choice there! They already learned how to run! May as well just double down on it! Oh god, no, 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 no! Come on! Oh, we made it! Oh, safety! Precious, precious safety! Uh, wait, is this one going up? These are supposed to go down. That's a little confusing. Oh my god! Oh my god! That was stressful. That was spectacularly stressful. Stuck in the middle with Cube! Oh, I should've- Oh, that's so good. That's so good, man. I wish I thought of that one. <sighs> Alright, can I get an updated distance? Please. No, but we've got an objective. It's not super far, but there's still gold robots. So, we, we got some distance, but we're not safe yet. There's still more to do. We are not home, we are not free. Between two urns. Alright. Alright. Gotta make sure I'm tagging gold robots as I see them. Important. Gonna be super important. Did it just bloop? Why did it bloop? I don't know. Still going this direction. Objective's still over there. Oh, but I can't hit the bridge! Do I need- Oh, please don't tell me I need him to hit the bridge. Can I not jump down? Can I just jump down? Oh, I can, but there's a gold robot right there, too. God dang it, if I jump down there, I'm dead. How about over here? Can I get some leeway if I jump down over here? Oh, there's another gold robot over there, too! There's so many of them! That looks like a bit of a death zone! Not gonna lie! That seems like a place I would go to die! 
Wait, is my objective that gold robot? Oh no. Does the gold robot have the sect scepter? Oh fuck no. Oh, I think the gold robot has the scepter. I don't know how to deal with this. I don't see any clones though. So it's possible I don't have to worry about teaching? Anything? That could be a thing? I don't know. That seems possible. Maybe I don't have to worry about them learning anything. In which case, that's one way to get the bridge open. You know, I think there's energy over here too. There is energy over here. Alright, let's try something stupid. Hey! Over here! Gain the lead. Hey! Master B, thank you for the 22 bits. I appreciate that. Awesome stealth action tonight. This game plays well and looks great. It's beautiful. Alright, you're gonna have to take some more drastic measures to get this guy's attention. Hey, stupid! Hey, stupid, come get me! Oh, hey, come get me, stupid! What you gonna do? What you gonna do? Oh! Oh no, you're gonna extend to the bridge! Yeah, good luck with that. Alright! <laughs> Basically, the stream catchphrase at this point. Grab some more energy. I may need to kill some more dudes before this day is over. Hopefully the gold robots can't use learn to use gun. If they can, I'm dead. But I don't think so. Hey, stupid! You gonna open the bridge? You wanna open the bridge, stupid? <laughs> yeah, I'm, that's what I'm worried about, Emperor. If that happens, I'm going to be so profoundly upset and also so profoundly dead. Both of those things is what I'm gonna be. Alright. Oh, that probably resurrected that gold one, didn't it? Oh, it doesn't matter. As long as the bridge is open. As long as the bridge is open, I can still progress. Yeah, it did resurrect that gold one. Shit. Well, that's awful. Get behind some cover. There we go. Oh, it's coming this way, too. Alright! Not great! Not quite the perfect awesome ending I was imagining. But I can still get to the elevator. I think. Oh, is it gonna turn to night again? Why? Why would it do that? No, it's not. Alright, cool. Right, let's summon that elevator. And then we might have to work quick down here. I'm gonna run out of energy in a sec, aren't I? Yeah, because I wasted a shot. I don't think I can teach them anything, though. No! No, I couldn't turn around fast enough. It jumped down the elevator? That I didn't say. Shit. Oh, god damn it. God damn, god damn. This area's gonna be hard. But this is what I'm assuming. I'm assuming... I'm assuming they don't learn anything. And if that's true, I can run and I can shoot here. So I think that's what we're gonna do. Let's do this area assuming that I can run and I can shoot. Change of pace, yes. But if it works, that'll be kind of cool. That will honestly be kind of cool. Let's see what we can do here. 
another one down there. Let's tag him. If I can. I might not be able to at this distance. There we go. Hoping I'd be able to sneak over there, but I don't think so. Alright, here's the plan. We're gonna sneak up on the one with the scepter. We're gonna kill the one with the scepter. And then we're gonna go quiet again. How does that sound, shit? What do you think of that plan? Rate my plan on a scale of 1 to 10. <laughs> oh god, there's so many, though. There's a couple I haven't tagged, too. God damn, there's too many! There is entirely too many. I can extend this bridge. This is going to give me a little bit of an alternate route. I think I need a bigger gun. Man, I wish I could get a better gun. Three chains out of five? I'll take that. I'm not a greedy man. I'll take that. I can live with that. All right. I want to sneak up on that one. Execute just that one, and then see if we can go quiet again. Or at least run like the Dickens. Maybe run like the Dickens and then go quiet? That's a possibility. Got it. All right. I think we got away. I think we actually got away with that. See how far we can get while it's dark. I don't think anyone or any of them are up here. I think they all went down there to hit, see what the noise was. So it might have actually cleared my path a little bit. Be cautious. Keep an eye out. Oh, there's some more energy up there. I can refill my gun. And also, oh, that's where we need to go. There's more people to give you neck hugs. The worst kind of hugs. I don't see any gold robots here. I don't see any gold robots here. I made it. Oh, we made it! Oh, we actually made it! Wow, look at all those urns. Oh! This is it, Edmund. We're here. You're breaking up. I'm hearing you fine, but the sphere is messing with your reception. If we're I cut out entirely, I'd better say this now. Good luck, Ed. And be careful. This is it. We found the center. Like being in the big blue room. But what's here? What's in the center? Hello? Where am I? What's your role? Enlightenment? Nothing? You're god now? I don't know. It'd be one of those things. Do we get a tattoo? Oh, that'd be pretty cool. I'm all this way. Expect at least a tattoo. What's right, this, this now? This looks important. <laughs> Alright. This looks a lot more high tech than the rest of the place. It must be making it from Foster's memories to ease his return. Hopefully. I think we lost contact with London, though. Look at the detail. Uh oh. Know what's happening? Still resetting. 
What's going to happen when it resets? What the? Wait, I'm, I'm out of my it's uniform. It's gone. Where'd the suit go? I think you're in for a disappointment. What? There's nothing in there. It's, it's just, just a pretty cube. cube. What? The fact that your grandfather did unspeakable things doesn't prove he was right. The Foster can come back. These are my memories. You have to say. This isn't about Foster. It's about me. You consider yourself the answer to the eternal questions of life and death. You killed him. No, you lost our chance. You killed him, you stupid bitch. And now you lost our chances of bringing him back. How clever is that? Looks like where the game started. We're in the ship, that's what we saw. The pure white planet. Foster. So that's how it is. Just like last time. Only one of us is getting out alive. That's all I asked for, I suppose. A chance to correct my mistake. I just didn't imagine it would be this damn difficult. Well, you said it, Gramps. Great challenges and equally great rewards. Take care, Foster. Of London as well. And there we go! That was Echo, ladies and gentlemen. Wobbin to Wonder Dog, welcome in. I was kind of wondering about that. That would be kind of cool if they unlocked that. <laughs> it's, a, it's a little vague. Yeah, let, let, me, let me give my thoughts about that. I think the concept of this is incredible. One of the coolest concepts I have seen in the last decade. I think the, the graphics are gorgeous. I love the, the palatial look of the different areas. And I was pretty happy with all of that. Um, it got a little bit repetitive. I think uh, those last levels were super challenging, although I only died like once or twice in there, so I wasn't too upset about that. But yeah, overall I think that was a good game. Overall I think I would recommend this one. Um, it, was, it was fun enough, it was tense enough, it was exciting enough. I felt challenged. Um, I felt challenged and I felt like I had to I had to really think about all of my actions. I, I felt like there was so much consequence to all my different actions. I enjoyed that. I thought that was neat. New settings available. We've got legacy mode. Enemies learn, unlearn over two cycles instead of one. Changing the dynamic fundamentally. That's brutal. And ultra hard difficulty. Harder than hard. And echoes need two shots to die. There's a hard mode in here as well. The, the difference with hard mode is that you don't have a radar. That spear around you that tells you where everything is going. Oh, oh my goodness. Emperor, thank you so much for being here. Thank you for the GG's, Jindraj, John Big Booty. I appreciate that. We're not going again higher difficulty. No, no, I don't think I can handle a higher difficulty. So which indie allegory is this one? Well, you know there's only two that I'm aware of, Rin. There's loss and there's death. You've got like cancer in there, but that kind of straddles the line. <laughs> so this one is death. Obviously, because you got posture there. <laughs> they are, there's always at least one in every indie game. That game was cool, Tom. Honestly, I think uh, 
I, I do recommend it. I do recommend it. If you're watching it and you think this looks fun, I highly recommend it. Unfortunately, I mentioned before, normally this is where I get, you know, super excited. Support those indie devs. Give them your cash so that they can, they close down. The maker of this game, a company called Ultra Ultra, uh, they unfortunately shut down. They did not make enough money to uh, be able to survive. So this is their only game. I still recommend picking the game up. But uh, unfortunately, the, the company's gone. We're not going to get a follow up. Uh, Jess, you say I cranked this out faster than than you did. I what did I do with this in uh, about eight hours total? I think I got about eight hours in there total. Um, whereas the casual time and how long to beat was about fourteen. But I could definitely see number one getting stuck more than I did. And number two, going for more optional things like the uh, tuning forks. But I can see that happening in there. Oh yeah, the menu is gorgeous, Jess. <laughs> Harder than hard. <laughs> it's a bad way to phrase it, John. Let's see. Three categories of games, Shooting Man, Depression Metaphor, and Nintendo. <laughs> to see the true... Oh god, I hate it when games do that, Lone Grin. Origami! There's another neat game too, Tom. I need to get around to playing Origami myself then. Oh my goodness, that was that was cool. That was cool. It wasn't a perfect game, but I, I think it was good. I think it was good, and I think it was something that I was happy with. Uh, let's see. Kondo, welcome in. Did you just won the game? I just won the game. We just beat the game. About total eight hours over two streams. Oh, that wasn't bad. So, yeah, I, th I think that is where we're going to wrap up for the day. We got our four hours in. Oh, you're wanting to see the end, Kundo? You can you can check the VOD if you want to. It was interesting. It was interesting. Uh, so yeah, I think we're going to wrap it up here for the night. Next week. Next week we're going to be streaming Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Same time as today. And we're going to be playing Dreamfall The Longest Journey. We're going to be starting that on Friday. That's the second in the Longest Journey series. Point and click adventure game is very, very highly rated. Um, I'm excited. It'll be my first time through Dreamfall. Um, I'm going in totally blind. I have no idea uh, what is in there. Um, so I hope you'll join us for that. Let's see. Geek Boy, I slept four to five hours longer than usual or I would have been here from the start. Oh, no worries, Geek Boy. I hope you got a good rest. Hope the extra four or five hours did you good and you're ready to attack the day. <laughs> Hopefully this is just the start of a good day for you, Geek Boy. Deviant Fish, thank you for the GG, and thank you everyone for being here. I hope you appreciate. I hope you enjoyed this game. I hope you enjoyed watching it. Um, if you're curious about it, you might pick it up yourself, or it makes a good gift. I'm sure. I'm pretty sure you can get it pretty cheap. Um, ending will be up on VOD or up on YouTube in a few days too, if you want to check that out. <laughs> and otherwise, I will see you guys next week for uh, 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 Dreamfall too. Let's see, Drev, I enjoyed it yesterday. Uh, today, to be honest, was too repetitive. I get that. I get that. Today was definitely... We spent at least half of today doing some of the same stuff that we did yesterday. So I can see that. I respect the opinion. I liked the gold things. That was a nice twist. And the short sequence where the clones were non-hostile. That was neat, too, but that was a very short sequence as well. Storyline was still good. I liked all those sections where the two characters were interacting. That was very good. I'm not actually sure if it is still available. I checked before the stream. Uh, Jess, it is. It is. I can confirm that. You have 9.5 hours on record. I probably got around that just from my tech test as well. Uh, that would make sense. All right. So, yeah, we're going to call the stream right here. I don't actually know how to exit from here. I have no idea how to get out of here. <laughs> God, I hate this menu. It's beautiful. It is gorgeous. Drac, thank you for being here. I hope you had a good time. So we've got one more thing to do before we wrap it up for today. Yeah, there was some repetition, if only because of the difficulty ramping up. True, true. I still think the game could probably could have stood to be an extra, about an hour shorter, but I enjoyed it. Overall, this one's a recommend for me. So one more thing to do before we wrap it up for the night. You may know what it is, folks, but stick around for just a moment because we are going to see who all else is online right now so we can hopefully go hang out with somebody cool and, uh, you know, find somebody to chill with. Find somebody cool to chill out with so we don't have to end the night here. 
Also, I can't get my mouse out of here. I cannot actually mouse out of this game. <laughs> so, oh wow. Can't actually do that. Alright. Alright, we, we, this is... What? I think I have to load my game so I can exit this. <laughs> Hang on a second, I'm having trouble getting out of the game. Oh, it's in settings, you think? Oh, I already clicked on a load save. <laughs> um, let's just check out this. How do I... How do I get my mouse out of this game? Nope, nope, there's no exit out of there. I think I have to load up a save. I think I might have to load up a save just to quit. It's horrible. No! It's not letting me load up any saves? Not letting me load up any saves. Cool. Oh, no, wait, I got my mouse out. We're safe. <laughs> so, yes, make sure to hit follow if you haven't already. So you get notified when I go online live next week. I'd love to have you all there. In the meantime, if you haven't seen them, Rin threw some links out that might interest you. Got a link to my Twitter if you want to see what I'm up to outside of the stream. Got a link to my YouTube if you would like to get caught up on this game or see some other games we play. Got a link to my Twitter. Or, sorry, got a link to my Discord as well if you would like to uh, hang out with us outside of the stream. We have some good conversations in there. Feel free to join us. And... Slim pickings today, but I do see somebody that I want to raid. Very cool streamer that I enjoy hanging out with. His name is Hippolito Picardo. He is on a quest to play every adventure game ever made. Yes, all of them. Literally all of them. And I would love to watch and see if he can pull it off. But you might too. So why don't you join us over there at Hippo Stream? Say hi to him. Throw him a follow if you like what he's doing. But if you got other things to do, I will just say as I always do. Have a good morning, afternoon, or evening, wherever you're at in the world. And I'll see you folks next week. Take care of yourselves. Till then, everybody.